What's up? Let's see. Comps are horrible. <clears throat> My internet went out yesterday too, by the way, guys, for like nine hours. Nine hours yesterday the internet went down. And I just got home from work. This is just some custom thing I seen that I signed up for. The comps today are horrible, so I might just do some free fishing. I don't know yet. What the hell is this one? No. This could be ugly, fellas. This could be real ugly. Good evening, Richard. Yeah, my internet went out yesterday right during Dave's thing and didn't come back on until 9 o'clock last night. <laughs> Richard, I got your luck on the internet there. And boy, does it suck when you don't have internet. What's up, Swamp? Oh, boy. Yeah, right, right during Super Dave's thing, I went to switch jig heads and I thought it was just a game glitching out and then... Yep, it was so bad, I had to watch, uh, we ended up watching a couple movies on DVD on my PlayStation last night. <laughs> it sucks when you don't have internet, man. <laughs> it's so bad. Yep, my internet came back on at 9 o'clock last night, so. Well, it was down in, it was down pretty much, uh like three counties in my area for whatever reason. I think I missed what you said, Richard. Boy, boy, this is not looking too fast. The hell, I thought that was a sockeye for a second. be brutal let's hope that doesn't happen <laughs> never thought I'd say that but yeah depends on the time of the year just off the coast of Africa there are two seismic plates that made contact breaking well let's hope that we didn't have a uh, that happen here or anywhere to be honest and yeah, we don't want no don't want no earthquakes or seismic activity for sure I don't even know how the hell I'm keeping up with these guys. Yeah. 
more disc golf yeah for sure <laughs> so i said depending on what time of year it was what you could do that might be the ball trophy no darn i can't see it it's late we'll take it Oh, half of that. Jeez, that's horrible, bro. Pretty good, Ezra. Other than the comps are horrible. Dave. My internet went out for about nine hours yesterday, Ezra, <laughs> right when I was playing in Super Dave's thing. And there were some good comps on yesterday, too. I didn't get to play in. What's up, Lucky? How's it going, man? I'm doing good, man. Just got home from work. Just got home from work. Should I rotate or go for this bull? Let's go one more time here. Go until we get another empty cast. Oh, I really don't want to go over to the other spot. Level 48, nice. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably do some Congo farming in between. I was thinking about doing Crank the River. Uh, I'll probably just get my butt kicked, but because I don't, I don't even know where that glitched out spot is. <laughs> the the, the schedule is horrible. It's Crank the River. Uh, Battle of and I think Bass Speed Hunt's all right. There's not even really any good customs. This was the only thing that I've seen, or anything sponsored at least. So I'll probably just have to do some free fishing. I'm thinking I should rotate out of here, huh? Oh, this is my first big match. Just got a trophy glass. Nice. Yeah, well, that's the thing. I doubt if I can even score 500, Richard, without a magic wall or whatever the hell it is. I don't even know where that spot is. I pretty much took that on my no playlist. Fishing for some bass at Klonchkin. Oh, you're getting limbered up for the... Uh, World Bass Tour, are you, Richard? Holy cow, man. I, mean, I, should, I don't know if I should just stay here. Well, let's just stay here. For a little bit anyway. One day making two. Yep. Like I said, the Congo's a pretty much an ATM, bro. This is uh, Kanik. I'm just playing in a custom thing. Cole, how's your day going, buddy? Here at Alaska. 
farming glass, nice. I think they're gonna give me this bull over here. Hey Alexander, how you doing, buddy? Uh depends on the tournament. There's three different times of comps. There's total weight or total points, where it's pounds per or per points per then there's gap competitions where you get the biggest fish and the smallest fish and then your gap determines your primary score uh, and then there's lucky competitions where you're just best weight match so there's three different types total score total weight gap point differential that's a, that sort of thing or lucky 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 fish doing good Cole doing good just got off of work and figured I'd enter into this custom thing just for fun here. It's pretty much just top water rodeo. Top water lures only for the uh, dolly and the boulevard in here at Kanik Creek. Oh, I don't know. This might be too big. We'll see what happens. The Congo video helped you good, man. Well, probably should put a two on, huh? There's the bull. Holy cow. <laughs> he grabbed that booger. Hey, Daniel, how's your day going, buddy? There's multiple options depending on what you're doing, Lucky. It's hard to answer that just with just one one rod, man. I got a bunch of rod reviews if you look around my gears and setups. Depends on if you're wanting to do bottom rod, spinning rod, casting rod, float rod. Come on, bro. Yeah, the way I did it, Lucky, I just kind of went through the lower end all the way to the upper end. And you can kind of see how to set them up. And then you can look in the shop and kind of see which one you have available. That would be my best advice. Nice, Daniel. Oh, man, I'm not going to get a bite, am I? Boy, this is dead. Rough going in fossils. That's the way that can treat you, Jail. <laughs> You've been... Oh, which one? Lucky the uh, saltwater giants. That's a tough one. Yeah, JL. Wait till you. <laughs> At least you've been doing good, JL, on the uh, the giant piranhas. Wait till you play in that one. They don't even give you a unique, bro. <laughs> even though you know how to do that one, and I've seen you do it. 
Sometimes the computer is just really mean, man. I'm trying to get at least a trophy over here for now. Oh, the bass speed hunt. Yeah, that's a fun one. You'll have fun with that. Look at the uh, thing on there, though. It might be... Uh, I can't remember if it's spinning rods only. That might be spinning rods only. I, I, I can't remember. I won that not too long ago, or took second, I think. In other words, if it says spinning tackle only, you'd have to use a spinning rod. I can't remember if it's spinning or casting. I know I use a spinning rod on it, though. Can I get one? Okay, yeah, you'd have to use a spinning rod. Most people would probably use the Zeus in that. Zeus, sometimes even a Thetis. Lord, I'm not going to be able to keep the pace like this. No, Crank the River is horrible. There's a there's a spot on the map. I don't even know where it is, bro. <laughs> there's a spot on the map that's glitched out that most of the players that know how to do it, they'll just sit and cast in one spot over and over. So it's really not that fun. I got my unique out of here anyway. But definitely not keeping pace with these guys. Oh boy. We're on, bro. Well, this is probably a waste going right here, too. But we'll do it anyway. Are you trying to fish on the bottom, Lucky? If you go for the Goliath, put your float shallow. That way the catfish don't interfere. If you're trying to bottom fish for them, it's kind of tough because the catfish are going to come up and take your bait. In other words, don't set your float too deep if you're float fishing. You're better off float fishing for those who are using the lure. Well, yeah, try not to set it very deep because the catfish will just come up and hit your shiners or your tilapia or your minnow. All right. I've seen enough of you. I guess you won't know until you get it in, bro. 
Hopefully it's a uni. I thought I had a uni before in that, or several times fishing for those, and sometimes you can't tell the difference between a big common and a unique. Those things can fight. Cool, let's just don't even get a bite now. All right, there should be two trophy bulls over here at least. dead. Oh, I had to work that rapid fire just to get a bite and he misses. Come on, bro. Hold on a second. Are these guys? Oh, damn. I thought they mixed in. Uh, <laughs> thought they might have mixed in something there, but they didn't. What is going on? Should I do the spinning only? What do you mean? Oh, spin form? That's up to you, bro. What hook to use for pikes? Uh, what lake are you at, bro? Are you at St. Croix? I would say if you could do 4-0 on one and maybe 6-0 on the other, 4-0 just to get steady bites and 6-0 to try to target the trophies. No, 5-0 is definitely not too much. It doesn't hurt to mix it up, though. You can put like 4-0 on one and 6-0 on the other to target, target the bigger ones. Keep a steady bite with a smaller one. I can't even get a bite. Well. Oh, jolly. Right on. Got a ways to go still, Lucky. Better better keep casting. They're going to be opening that ocean map at some point. Better get up to level 80 as quick as you can. Oh. I'm gonna buy no messes. Oh, at least we got interest. We'll take it. Come 
Oh, that was a trophy too. Come on, bro. Come back. Yeah, Congo 75. I'm just saying that you'd want to get the max level that way. Uh, it's, because you'll have to go from 80 to 83 to go to the uh, ocean map. That's why I was saying that, Alexander. Because the current max level is 80. So I, ideally, you could get the max level before that thing opens. Then you only got three levels to go. Because even though it's only three levels, they could have made the the XP uh, higher per level, if that makes sense. Who knows what they're going to do? That's just me thinking out loud. Because I thought for sure they were going to make like level 85 or 90 or something like that to get to the uh, the ocean, but they're saying level 83. But you don't know how, how far the level is from 80 to 81, so on and so forth. Because it could go up exponentially. This has been a weird one. We haven't missed very many fish. Just ain't got the bite. No bites. I don't think it matters what we throw. Oh, what's up, Keith? I just can't get a bite. Finally. Take it. Keith, are you going to try crank the rock or crank the river? GG's, boys. GG's.
Alright, well that was fun. <laughs> I signed up for it. I don't know for sure if I'm... I, that's one I don't have on my list, Keith, just because it, there's a glitched out spot and I don't... Normally, I could go on and play in it, I guess, just to have, try to have fun. But yeah, they'll score... I can't remember what they score in it. 2,400 or something stupid. Oh no, I'm gonna get froze. I think there's an there's an it's Keith here on uh there's another Keith. It's probably the same one because there's an it's Keith on PlayStation. It's not it's not our, our Keith. It's a different Keith. There's a lot of Keiths. Cool. Now we're froze. Oh, now we're froze big time. Oh, come on, bro. Let me out of here. Man, after yesterday, my internet crashed, and I don't want to deal with this nonsense. That's a bad thing when you enter these. I'm froze. I can't even move, bro. Are you kidding me right now? Come on. There we go. Is it going to let me leave? Let me leave, please. It's not going to let me leave. All right, well, I guess we'll have to do that momentarily. Yeah, it's probably, it's Keith, like... K E E V or K E V F or something. I can't remember. K E E F. Yeah, there's one. There's a guy over here by the name of that. Does he got like a blue emblem? For an avatar. Come on, bro. That's not even going to let me out of here, bro. Come on. Yeah, the RFF one. You know it's what I'm talking about, Keith. He's got. There's no E behind it. It's got like a weird little blue emblem. Yeah, he's a good player. Okay, cool. They let me out of here. Thank you. I got to change back. I don't know why it does that when you play in a sponsored comp. It does it almost every time. Something's wrong with it, fellas. Let me try to, okay, I left the lake. Now let me get back to English. Boy, and the schedule's horrible today. Yeah, that one's fun. It's just to crank the river, man. Well, and the, the one's all right. Canique's all right. Let's see if it freezes me this time. Don't freeze me, please. Thank you. 
I'll definitely play in these two falls, but I'm not sure on Crank the Rock yet. I'll stay signed up for it and just see what happens. I may go into it. Yeah, these 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 two are fun. Moonlight Gar is fun if you get a bite. If you don't get a bite, it's not really that fun. Let me see if there's any other customs. Oh, hold on, hold on. Cost bar. Let me guess, cost bar. Please don't be labio again. I don't know if I can handle the humiliation. <laughs> I don't know, boys, if I could handle another beatdown in that. That one's so painful. I'll debate. I'll debate it, fellas. He should go back after the Cornish Jack or something. He loves the he loves those labio. Alex, why does he love those labio so much? He loves those things, don't he? <laughs> loves these things oh cost bar loves the labia on the jig head at night <laughs> that, that was bad <laughs> he does love those I'm surprised they don't do tiger fish or uh, Cornish Jack or something you're gonna do that one yeah, yeah. all right guys let me uh set up for let me see what the hell I even want to do. I don't know if I want to do that one, man. That one's so painful. Well, it's only commons, though. <laughs> only the commons count, Richard, but it's something's better than nothing. <laughs> oh, man. That's a tough one. If you're. What do you mean? Lucky. I got it. I got a clip up on that. I just did good on that the other day. If you're wanting to know how to do the uh, bass speed hunt, look on my podiums. Look on my podiums, Lucky. It's got marks and everything else, man. I just put a video up on that last week, I think. Let me see what the hell do I want here. 53. What was I doing over here on this? Where do you find the wells on Octuba? <laughs> Are you really looking for wells on Octuba? Alex, you should be able to do a spot for him, bro. You should be able to do a spot for him. I haven't, I haven't fished the wells for a while. Any, any deep spot, but to be honest, you could, you could do a spot for him if you're being, if you're being serious, bro. Oh, you spot and still not find them? Remind me, and I'll mess with it. It should. Just be about the same. I used to get them on accident, Alex. I was trying to spot for uh, what the hell was I doing? I was spotting for recatch and caught them things on accident, man. <laughs> oh, it's for a mission. Oh, like the recatch. Is this what the hell I was doing on this thing, bro? I don't even remember what the hell I was doing on this thing. That don't seem right. Hold on a second. Oh, on leeches? Wolf. <laughs> yeah, I would definitely spot for him. I guess that's all I got. Hold on, let me double check this. That don't seem right. Is there not... Why does that not seem right? Is there not anything there? 50 pounds? Oh, there's not. 53. Why is there no 50? That's dumb. Uh, not too bad, Prodigy. How you doing? What's up, North? How you feeling, North? You back to 100% back to yet, buddy? That is odd. I guess they don't have one. I guess that's why they did have on that. Huh. Guys, I, I really, I don't know if I want to do Crank the River. Should I torture myself for an hour and crank the river? Oh my God, I don't know if I want to. Does it have to be a trophy or better? Let me, let me go over there real quick. Hold on, let me look real quick. 
I'm not going to fish for him right now, but let me look for you, bro. Yeah, and you can't get burned out on the con you can't get burned out. I'm thinking Congo. You can't get burned out on the Congo already. Hold on, guys. Let me put my chat up here. I'm losing losing track. I used to spawn somewhere over here. Let me look for you real quick, though. There's a spot. I know you can spawn and get some nice ones. And shallow, believe it or not. Oh, Prodigy. Look around on my channel. I got an amazing... Uh, I got a good... I got a good... Uh, look on my playlist, farm, Farming Lakes, Prodigy. I got a lot of marks for uh, Arapaima. But yeah, any one of these deep spots, bro. But hold on. I thought I spotted for these things. Or maybe it was Beluga. What the hell was I doing over here? I'm pretty sure I was just spotting right there, bro. You can... Oh, man. There's no telling, Alex. I got too many marks. Oh, right there. Right there, Alex. You need rotations? Yeah, look yeah, look look at it. I got a I actually got a thumbnail on that one, Prodigy. Look at my farming lakes and scroll down. I got Triera Shark and a uh, nice Arapaima guide. <laughs> I don't know, big. You know me, bro. I, I don't know. But yeah, it shouldn't matter. Big's right, it shouldn't matter. But yeah, I could probably clean up some of these on big. I have no idea, bro. Let, let me let me look through this mess. <laughs> I don't know, man. Why do I have? I don't know. I have no idea. I definitely don't need that. <laughs> what the? Why the hell did I save that? Some of these I needed for something. I don't remember what. I'll probably need them one day. Perch farm. I remember farming the perch there. Yeah, I don't need that either. What the hell? I caught that on a spinner. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, by the way, big. The other day I played off off stream because I had a house full of people, so I couldn't stream. I did play the. Uh, <laughs> I did play. Big, I did kind of use your method the other day. Or, or there's a there's one. There's a spot too. I'm pretty sure I was spotting for this though. But anyway, big. The other day I went through here, and I just rotated about how, however so many squares, and I came through here, dude. And I, where the hell did I get that at? I just went through there with Pike. Oh, <laughs> there's one. I was in Mandarin. I played this in Mandarin the other day. Just so you know, I played Party of Five big. If you're falling long, there's my there's my Mandarin mark, boys. Top secret stuff. I I really don't think it matters as long as you space them out. But comically enough, I played in Mandarin off stream. Uh, and I only needed one more unique. Let me look and see if I can find it. Where the hell was it? I think I had a my all time high in that Party of Five. Oddly enough, which I thought it was odd, I had to. Go off in another. Where the hell was that? Party of five. Oh, that wasn't that. Yeah, look, looky there, big. I only needed one more. I only had three uniques in that too, and I just went through and spaced myself. <laughs> in other words, that holds true on those pike even big. Oh, God. Does anybody not want to do the... Keith, if you're still there, you should have to do this with me if I'm going to play in this piece of crap. I really don't want to. Well, these two are fun, kind of. All right.
Okay, you're not going near the rock. All right, we'll do it legit. Yep, I would agree. One hold, one hold. It seems to hold true on all of them. Big. On just about every damn thing, seems like. Oh, and I got a... Uh, it wasn't big enough big, but... I got... what? Hold on a second. Where the hell is that? I got an oversized asp too, bro. Hold on, I gotta show you. It wasn't giant. Where the hell was that? Oh, of course you did, Keith. How convenient. <laughs> Keith. Bro, come on. Look at that big. It wasn't it wasn't enormous, man. But I did get an oversized asp. I did spot for that. I did spot for that right off the right off the boat dock too, big. I didn't get these enormous ones these guys got, but I enough to get me in fourth. I think Keith was up. Yeah, Keith was up there. But yeah, that that comp there is forever changed now. You have to spot in that or you'll never have a chance. I know, <laughs> Lucky, I gotta I gotta play along for that, man. I got all kinds of stuff for comps. It, it'd be hard for me to go through and explain it. You're you want points per. If you want real help on it, watch the video. I just took second in that the other day, and I think Keith Keith took first and right behind me or something. Well, that's the whole thing, and I didn't get to play in this last night because my internet shot craps yesterday for nine hours, which is absolutely horrible. But I'm pretty sure Big, I'm pretty sure Big and Richard both these guys are spotting for these now, almost to a certainty. You just got to figure out the mix and the rotation. I don't think they're trying to get the oversized ones, but maybe. I don't know. That's a big one. Uh, I'm thinking Giovanni and these guys have figured out a way to get multiple, multiple. Uh, Unique asp. I think they're spotting in this almost to a certainty now, Richard. Just got to figure it out. But I, I'm with you guys. It gets to the point of a lot of these things you're going to have to spot for just to even have a chance anymore. But yeah. Nope. I don't think so, Big. I think what they're doing, because the, the guy stopped by from, uh, what was that guy's name, Richard? He's he's one uh one of the big groups over there big, the TWT or whatever they're called TNT, one of those big groups over there because he came, he stopped by the channel and said that's what they're doing. Well, I think they're doing it to get extra uniques from one spot, is what he was saying. That that TNT guy swore that he was getting seven uniques in three spots big. Seven uniques in three spots. The TNT guy. Yeah, Martian or whatever his name is. So, oh my God. Keith, did you really not sign up for this dumpster? Do I go over here and humiliate myself for an hour? I don't know if I can take an hour of it. it sounds like a lot of work. Yeah, that's what, yeah, they're just clones or duplicates or whatever you would call them. Extra uniques. They're getting extra uniques. Uh-huh, sure, Keith. <laughs> oh, my God, bro. I mean, I don't care about my personal learning. If you guys want me to want to watch me fish for uh, 400 points for an hour, I can. If you guys want to watch me free fish or go in here and embarrass myself in this debacle. Oh, do I even have another mini crank? <laughs> is that is that rod even big enough? I don't know if it's big enough there. Should I do a... Hold on a second. I'll go over there and just get my butt kicked. I don't care. Or I could just go farm. Farm or embarrass myself and crank the rock. What should I do, fellas? Right. 
Well, that's that's all I'll get. I'll go over there and get 500 points doing it the traditional manner. <laughs> I literally have not even. Super Dave put a video up on it a long time ago, hoping that the devs would fix it, and they never have. But maybe it'll be on the list. The list of fixes. It might take me 20 minutes to find the reel I'm looking for. It don't exist. No, Prodigy, I'm on uh, I'm on PS5, bro. No, if I was on PC, that'd be too many, too much overload. My son has a gaming PC. My middle, well, both of my sons do. My older sons, they they play on other platforms. The crank the rock. I know it's. Uh, I don't. Richard and uh, Big Legit both play there. Yeah. <laughs> Big. You know how I am with technology. Can you imagine me try? I, I'm. I'm. Barely capable of running my uh, my laptop, bro. <laughs> I, I still have to have my son help me with my laptop, man. <laughs> there, there's no way in hell you guys can imagine seeing me on. I can't even find the reel I'm looking for. And I don't even think it's going to matter. Should I just... Hold on, I'm just going to bring an extra boomer. I'll go into this thing. Boomers. <laughs> I'm not quite a baby boomer, bro. I, I'm Gen X, but I mean, I was raised old-fashioned. I did keep up my flip phone for uh, six years longer before I wanted to go to touchscreen. So if that tells you anything, I am old fashioned. All right, we got two of these. What could go wrong? And Keith, are you telling me that N slips already got 700 points? I could have swore, bro. You're on Steam Prodigy. Oh, this is going to be ugly. Oof. Oh, yeah. And Slip and Bam count on their weekly points in this. <laughs> You went negative when you first played on console. <laughs> yeah. It was bad times. Well, that would be... I don't even know. I wouldn't even know where to begin with a mouse and keyboard, boys. I would not even know where to begin. Oh, this, this looks horrible. These guys are cranking the hell out of that rock over there. Bam, Bam's drilling at the mouth and N-Slip's drilling at the mouth. They're trying to get those personal points up. All these guys are just going to town over there. All right, let's see how, let's go in there and see how bad we can do with the traditional manner. If I can somehow get 500 points, I guess I did my job. Oh, as that's big. I don't know, bro. I need to buy some. That's why I got the uh, big. Is there a cap on that? Is there a cap, guys, on the storage he was asking? Yeah, they're in there exploiting it. I'm going to go in this fish it the regular way. Well, to be honest, fishermen, they should. <laughs> the dubs should have fixed that glitch by now. I guess they don't care. I, I don't know. That's my opinion on it. They could have fixed that by now, but maybe it's a really hard issue to fix. As far as I know, there is no... Yeah, I don't think there is either. I'll get some when the new map opens up, but I probably got 75,000 liters I could delete at some point. Yeah, I got a lot of liters. I could go through and free up space if I wasn't lazy. There's a lot of liters I could get rid of. About 6,000. 
<laughs> Look at the leaders. Holy! All right, let's get out of here, boys. I'm trying to program. I'm trying to prolong the agony here. I appreciate it, fisherman. I do try to do that. All right, boys. This is gonna be brutal. This is gonna be ugly. This is gonna be an hour that you'll never get back. All right, here we go, boys. We're just gonna try to catch a couple. See what we can do. Oh, a mass delete? Yeah, I wish they did too. That's why I'm being lazy. I could go through there and trip. The X Series Plus bait is an absolute destroyer, bro. I hated it at first. Here's what you're gonna find about it, Prodigy. It swims differently. It's like really it's like trying to tug along a Volkswagen. It's really heavy, it's awkward. But once you get the hang of it, I love it in the uh, several things. But for sure, the bass speed hunt, you can couple it with whatever pairing you like. I love it in the bass speed hunt. Steady, steady bite. Obviously, any bass like it. It takes a little getting used to because you'll see what I'm saying. Even though this is lighter, it just swims weird, man. Yep. And I can tell you the giant piranhas, I got several of them now, but. I think giant piranhas is the easiest one to get it in, in my opinion. It's the giant piranhas. That's where I got my first one, or my first five. All right, here we go, boys. Let's just go get this crap show over with. Woof. All right, boys, I'll be lucky to hit 500. Can I, uh, what the hell was I doing? Big, do you remember what I did in this last time? Because I don't. <laughs> I got a few spots. I think I can fish off the bank, too. I'm going to start off the bank. Guys, I'll be lucky to get three or four trophies in this. I'm not even joking. This is going to be horrible. I'll be lucky to get uh, 500 points in this thing, man. I'm not even kidding. I, don't even, I know I can catch them over here. Uh, I just do Share Factory, bro. But if you're looking for tips on technology, I'm not the guy to ask. I haven't done this one yet. <laughs> yeah, well... Well, you just you just got to get in there and start start casting, Prodigy. Yeah, JL, this one's not uh, until they work on it. What the hell? Okay, this is odd. Did I change that? What is going on on my? Hold on, we got this on simple. This this can't happen. Something's going on here. All right. Well, we got a we got a grayling, which is a good thing. But who in the hell has been touching my stuff? I did that on accident. How the hell did I do that? Aha! Is that going to reset me? It's not going to reset me, right? All right, there we go. Did that take me out? No, it didn't. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was scaring me for a second. If I lost this X-Series crankbait, I'd be in trouble. All these guys are going for Linux too. I never thought about going for the Linux. I could go for the Linux. It's got to be a mini crank though. Maybe I should go for the Linux. How I got? Well, I don't know. I don't know how I get a, a young Wells on a uh, in the party of five either. But I always find a way to do it, Alex. Oh, uh, Ethan, they're older now. Uh, my oldest son's oof, 25, my middle son's 23, and my daughter's 21. Are there, or no? They might be 22, 24, 26, or 20. They're either 22, 24, 26, or 21, 24, or 21, 23, 25. I don't know, I'm getting old, bro. Oh, that was actually a decent fish. I want a trophy before I leave.
Oi. I thought this was going to be painful. I can't believe Keith left me alone over here. Jerky. Okay. I thought for sure. I was counting on this spot to give me a trophy toss. It's not even going to give me a trophy. Alright, one more cast. Let me try to get it. Let me try something. Let me get over here, maybe. Let's try this. What in the hell is that music? Oh, this is going to be brutal. I find it comical they're jumping over here, too. Oh, boy, this is going to be rough. Well, I got 75 anyway. All right, let's come over here. Let me try right here first. Something hit that. I flew out of the water, whatever it was. Well, these guys really got that rock down. Maybe they hit 3,000 in this key. Well, I don't know. <laughs> oh, they already got 1,300. 10 minutes in. They might. <laughs> Who knows? I haven't. I haven't played in the. I did the comp play along on this, doing it the traditional way, probably about four months ago, Keith. I haven't played in it since. I haven't really wanted to, but. I keep holding on to the hopes that they'll they'll fix the map. <laughs> well, they got it down to a fine art for sure. The, the sad part, all jokes aside, is this thing, this comp actually gives away uh, really good awards, so I could see why they keep doing it. Oh, I can't even get a bite, bro. Not even a nibble. Yeah. 
Yeah, I thought about doing that, putting a little rotation together. I was going to do that at some point when they if they actually fix it, but. Well, too, Richard, you probably got to factor in whatever RNG you're dropping to. It's probably like playing in a one by one, Richard, when you're getting nothing but swim offs. I could picture that too. If you follow along with what I'm saying, if you get bad RNG in the wall, <laughs> we know how the similar people seem to get really good RNG over and over. Uh, Trophy Wells. And Richard, I don't know if you watched that little clip I put up when I put up uh, 7 or what was it? 785 or? Yeah, I put up 785 in Bloody Threat, Richard. I was getting super RNG, and I was scratching my head afterwards thinking, how, do, how does one get that, that RNG over and over? I always wondered. Seven eighty five and bloody threat. And the guy that beat me in slip put up eight hundred and eighty. <laughs> About time, Alex. What were you doing over there? You know what I'm saying, Richard? It just makes no sense. All right, boys, I don't even know if I'm going to hit 300. Hold on. Where is my grailing spot? What the hell do I even have out here? Aha! I wonder, I was casting at the wrong spot. This thing's deeper or what? Dude, we can't even get a bite. Why didn't I just go farm the Congo or something? Who in the hell talked me into this? Oh, yeah, I got a few markers here. I don't know what they're all for, but yeah. All right, boys, we are on the gray lane. All right, boys, it's possible. We got about 48 minutes to get to 500. That's our target, boys, 500. <laughs> 25 points at a time here. <laughs> oh, man. If you're feeling all right, you just got the cough lint remaining. Well, that's good, man. Hopefully the cough goes away, too, for you. At least you're feeling better, North. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this mini crank just not good? I mean, it's... Whoa, what am I doing with the rod stand? I can't use the rod stand. Hold on here. I thought I had... Oh, I did not set that up. Hold on, boys. Secret weapon here. It's got to be this one. This one on a jig winner. Heaven forbid the X-Series mini crank does something for you. I mean, it should be perfect for this comp. Steady point, steady bite. Nope. We're trophyless. We're not even going to get a trophy, I don't think. Oh, oh, hold on. <laughs> it just looks like a big fish, boys. I'm rocking a jig winner, man. Rocking the jig winner. <laughs> oh. All right, boys. 
We got the trophy, fellas. We are on our way to 500. We're a little off pace, though, I think. That was down deeper, too. That could be the issue. Should I try to get a Linux on this setup? <laughs> it's going to die now, Richard. I'm pretty sure that was down deeper, too. Should I just do the old boring way and just reel it in? Does anybody remember how to catch a unique grayling? Because I don't. Our options are limited, are limited since we're mini crank only. So, I mean, there's only so many ways you can work this thing. Definitely like hitting it on their eyes. He missed it. Oh, he got it. That's not a yinny though. Is that even a grayling? Does this fish count? What is this? A humpback or something? Oh, that didn't even count. What the hell? That's an eyed. Can we catch the bark? <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think we can. Let's see. Hold on, I might regret this, but we'll see what happens. Not ideal if I hook into a Linux, but oh my god. No wonder I can't catch fish, I'm on the bank. <laughs> Don't make me break out my spod, spod rod, Richard. What, can we spod for the grayling? Does anybody know? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, hold on. That reminds me. I'm going to go try a spot. Hold on a second. I do. Rem oh, no, actually. Is there another spot over here? I seen Grayling jumping over there once. What is this over here? Oh, there's all this over here. Pike. Gray Link. Hold on. I'm probably going to have to go get my boat. What if I had a pike? That will not be good. All right, let's, let's try it, fellas. There is a gray Link mark there. Oh, short caster. All right, now, if I had a pike on this, it's probably not going to be a good time. Yeah, I got I got a couple. Of, I got another spot I was wanting to try to. Hold on. It's not looking good. Hold on, let me go get my boat. I did notice one thing the last time I played in the bobber burbot. So let me go try something down here at the end. And then I wanted to see, because I was playing Bobber Burbot the other night, and I seen Grayling jumping at a couple of my Burbot spots. So maybe they go hand in hand. But let me go hit. I got a spot down here somewhere. Not, yeah, that spot I'll come back to. I'm pretty sure I had another spot over here somewhere. It's not that one, though, is it? What the hell is that? All right. Hold on. Why did I mark that? Is that a spot? Nope, burbot. Ooh, another burbot spot. 
All right, there we go. Let's try this. I think there might be a Linux over here too. Can't remember. All right, boys, I don't think we're gonna have 500. Oh, okay, hold on. That, I don't know what that is. That's gotta be a gray line, right? Trophy gray line? There we go, boys. It's a little on our size, but we'll take it. How you doing, Alistair? Okay, that didn't work out well. All right, let's see if we can get at least a common, maybe. If we could just figure out how to get a steady bite of the commons would be great. Uh, pretty good, man. Work was a little cold this morning. 24 degrees this morning. We had to wait for the frost to lift and we mowed and stuff. But Pretty good, man. One of those, I got cold this morning. I'm still cold. Other than that, I'm doing well. Thank you. My internet went out yesterday for about nine hours, so it's back on, so that's a good thing. And let's see here. All right, well. I'm kind of disappointed in this X-Series Mini Crank, I'm not going to lie. It's 36 degrees. Well, it's going to get up to 60 something today. It was just really cold overnight and this morning. It's supposed to warm back up later this week. Only 36 where you're at. All right, well, somebody's alarm's going off. Hmm. One more cast. Yeah, that's a Linux. It does appear those guys are supplementing in Linux as well, because those are some, those are not Grayling. A 
so I think y'all. Oh, it does? Okay, I didn't know that. <laughs> so they're hitting. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Never mind, they are exploiting. I thought maybe they actually put a rotation together or something. So there's cranking the rock for Linux and Grayling. That makes sense now. I wonder why they still haven't fixed that. Like, why wouldn't they fix that? That makes no sense. Last cast for crying out loud, bro. Oh, and the mole, so they're getting three scoring fish off of one. So they're, it's basically like one by one with a crankbait. <laughs> Two and a half year old brother was. Me outside and picked up a rock and tried to hit me with it. And hit him in the so his cell phone. Uh-oh. Is he okay? I hope he's okay. But nonetheless, that's one of those instant karma things. Uh, Ezra, Keith was supposed to play this with me, but he failed to sign up on purpose, I think. I think it was intentional, boys. He left me out here by myself, Ezra. Okay, I'm going to try right here. Just because I've seen... Oh, he got stitches out. Ah, uh, sure, it was merely an accident. <laughs> oh, he ended up with stitches? Dang it, man. All right, I did see Grayling jumping back here once when I was fishing for burr, but... So I'm just going to see if they're over here. They may not even be over here, but let's try anyway. Okay, I did get a bite. Don't know if it was a grayling or not. I don't think Burbit bite these, but maybe. Oh, and he got a concussion. Jeez. I don't know about this spot. I think Keith told me to come over here and try this spot for us. Okay, we had another miss. Is that the only way they bite in this? I feel like that's the only bite I've got. Hold on. Tuck one right there. I swear I seen Grayley jump over here. The last time I played Bob or Burbit. Well, I haven't seen Zat today, so you have to be the uh, takeover where he usually leaves off. Okay, that's another miss. What the hell's missing that? Is that kind of mole or something? Okay, hold on. If this is a grayling, we're in we're in luck. No, that is not. Oh, it is a grayling. Yes, and it's a trophy, boys. Hold on, marking it. All right, boys, if you ever need it, we got a spot here. There's, I told you there's Burbit there. Okay, so we know they're coupled together. So, hold on, let me try one more cast. Took a while to buy it. I doubt they'll give me two. Oof. 
Man, I hope he gets better, Alistair. Even if he was trying to hit you with a rock, nonetheless, nobody likes to see that happen there. So hopefully he gets well soon. Maybe, bro. I'm going to go fish another spot by my bourbon here in a second. I'm trying to get... All jokes aside, man, I really would think this thing would get... I don't really use this thing this much. Hey, Dizzy. I'm trying to do the uh, crank the rock the legit way. It's not going very well, but I'm having fun, man. How's your day going, Dizzy? Appreciate it, buddy. Doing pretty good, Dizzy. Doing, doing better today. I had a, my internet went out yesterday. And then it was cold at work this morning. So it was so bad when our internet went out, Dizzy. We ended up watching the Goonies. I don't know if you know that. Me and my wife watched the Goonies last night on uh, my PlayStation 5 on DVD. <laughs> Your internet goes out. You can't stream Netflix, Hulu. It's like everything cease to exist almost like you don't know what to do all right we got two fish in one spot a miracle i don't know if it's a scoring fish but what is that a perch or something okay well that's not a good sign it's an eyed oh, all right last cast I'm dying to see if that other burbot spot will give me a grayling or not. I think it might. I think there's two spots that might. That me and the wife were saying that we were actually kind of uh, we weren't happy the internet went out, but it was funny. We were looking because I haven't because normally we just stream off of and watch uh, Hulu or Netflix or Amazon Prime or whatever, but. We went and looked through our old DVD collection and we both agreed on watching Goonies. But man, that show or that movie, that thing definitely stands the uh, test of time. It was it was still good to watch it. Yeah, I seen, uh, seen Dizzy was up around spinning a trial. Good stuff, man. All right, so... These guys are going to hit 4,000 in this thing. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to go try a couple of my burbot spots just to see. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, I got a burr. We know the... Oh, hold on. Should I hit this over here? Let me let me try this just for a second. If this map would ever load. Instead of fishing this off the bank. Let me try. Let me try throwing this through here just for fun. Is the UK map good? Uh, yes. Oh, and I did get the trophy. Nice. Right in front of me. Sweet. 
All right, let's don't go. Let's don't get greedy because you know they're not going to give us any next phones. Let me try one cast at this burbot spot. And then I'm going to go try a couple other burbot spots. I just want to see if they're together. They might be. Took the spinner tail off. I'll try it next time. Dizzy. I'll try that next time in that man. Alright, I'm gonna try this right here because I swear the last I got a burbot marker right there. The last time I was playing Burbot 2, I seen a gray lane over here. So let me just see anything. It might just all be around these rocks. Who knows? I never really thought about putting a gray lane rotation around. And obviously, if you're serious about contending in this one, you got to jump in and do the crank the rock with these guys. Yeah. Split the time with the dam and the... Yeah, I'll try that. I'm going to... I'm going to go back the way I was doing it and then go to that other spot next time, Dizzy. Because if I could just get my unique and trophy marble from there and then go down and hit another spot. Fellas, I didn't even have a nibble here. Well, this spot's not. Oh, okay, I had a nibble. Hold on, that might have been a gray line. Try hold on a second. Let me drag it right in front of the rock. Maybe that's the plan. Oh, he's not. Well, we'll be curious to see if he goes into another club. It looks like him and Bam are bat battling the uh, Crank the Rock there. They both need those personal points, I'm sure. I'm sure they got all the rewards. What the hell is this? Is this even a... What is that? Oh, a Dace. How about that? All right, last try. Last try here, fellas. A 
was hoping that was a Garmin, but I know I seen one jump over here. That might be. No, what the hell is that? A trophy dace? Okay, we found a dace spot. A trophy dace. <laughs> Woo, boys. Okay, nope, that's Pike. Hold on, let's see. No, I'm not down there. That's dangerous. That's dangerous because we know there's pike there. Let's try. Where was that other spot? Right here. Oh, this is dangerous too. Let's try it anyway. Yeah, somebody else was saying that Enslip left him. Who knows? Maybe he's going to start a club of his own. Well, after them winning that club series the last time, I doubt they need anything in the game at all. That's a lot of rewards they got for that thing, I think. Club tokens, bait coins, it's I can't remember. I don't know if it was... Did they get all those rewards per person or was that divvied out 10%? Or whatever, I wonder. I wonder how that worked. I know those rewards were massive for taking first place in the club series thing. So I'm pretty sure they probably need nothing in the game now. It was per person. Well, yeah, they're all rich then. Club tokens, the rods and reels. Did they get a boat too or no? Did that thing come with a boat? They got the king's ransom. I'm pretty sure, yeah. I, I didn't know how it broke out. I didn't know if it was divvied out between the 20 players or what, however. Man, I'm not even going to hit 500 plus. I can't even. <sighs> There's got to be a Grayling over here somewhere. Or anything. How about a stick? I bet I got a stick, though. Oh, man. got bark we got bark fuzz well we dodged bark this time oh the club carp and the spot rods yeah they did look pretty cool man I'll be curious to see what what the hell is this. I hope this isn't a pike. Hey, Abdul, how you doing, buddy? Oh, it was a pike. I'm going to have to be careful. <laughs> he didn't get a reward? That's weird. I wonder why he didn't get a reward. All right, I better get the hell out of here. I don't want to lose my club series uh, or my club series. My X series mini crank. Let's let's don't cast there. That is not a good idea. I don't really want to go back over there. 
Thanks, Fisherman. I appreciate it, man. You have a good day. Thank you for stopping by, sir. Sorry it wasn't more exciting, fella. One of these days they'll fix this and we'll have a rotation together and have a little more. Uh, where is that other spot I want to try? Let me try down here. I got to be careful over here too, but let me just see. Looks like there could be a grayling here. Dude, if I get bit off on a pike, I'm going to take that down just in case. I know there's a pike on the other side of there, but... Right on, buddy. I appreciate it, man. Oh, hold on. That felt like a good thump. That was something good. Wasn't a dace. Oh, don't be a pike. Oh, God. Is it a pike? I think I'm on a pike again. It is a pike. I better get the hell out of here. All right, boys, we're finding pike everywhere. <laughs> Let me try over here. This looks, this looks promising. Ah, uh, this is Solange. This is a fun map. It's a beautiful map. They put so much into it though that the uh, the map loads really slow, so you kind of got to drive your boat around. Pretty... Is that another pike? We are on the pike, fellas. Holy cow! All right, well, at least we're making money. I am not casting there again. I don't want to lose this. Let me see. Where else could we try? Okay, we already know they're up here, but... Uh, let me try it. Oh, man. Let me try it. Probably get a pike over here too, because I know I got a uni mark over there somewhere. Let me try right here though. I keep hoping if I drive around, I'll just see him jumping. This will be a project for Keith. Keith, we need to work on a a grayling rotation and a Linux rotation. Maybe. non-rock yep i think in the long run it would help us keith surely the devs will work at that at some point i know they're busy with that new map or whatever but surely at some point they'll fix that because can you imagine just being a guy right now playing in this not having any idea that they're just cranking into a wall <laughs> it's called solange The name of the map is Solange, bro. It's fun. This is a fun map. Most people fish it for the uh, taming. But the northern pike here are fun. I got a little rotation I used to do for fun for the uh, pike. The pike and the taming probably the number one and two things. Fish. We're in the Linux. The Linux are all right. Uh, I have to, I don't know. You'd have to scroll way down on my maps or my, uh, list somewhere. I got, I think a four or five spot rotation that I use. Mainly around the groups of the trees. I've noticed I found them. The trees and a couple of the canals I found them up in. The brush piles, in other words. Well, it doesn't look like they're going to hit 3,000, but they 
Might hit 2700. Let's see if I can at least get a Linux or a Grayling here. Something. Come on, man. Oh. That was a Linux. I seen the wake. Bummer, bro. Uh, realistically, though, I probably could have camped the two, two, two or three spots and probably hit seven hundred naturally, but. I kind of like moving around the map. That's another shame about it is this map's so beautiful. It's a shame that the uh, there's a spot that gets exploited. Nine more painful minutes. Oh God, is that a Taman? I think I got a Taman. Okay, that don't count. Thirty-nine pound Taman. Let's go this way. <laughs> I knew it wasn't a Linux as soon as it hit, because even the Linux, I don't think, would have, not on a river sperry, would have put up that fight. But I'm glad I didn't throw my jig winner over there. I did think about it a second ago, but I know this little Linux spot borders the uh, taming. For sure. <coughs> oh, look at him. Neck and neck race up there. wonder who's going to get the final respawns there.
Well, I was just thinking, since it's an hour comp, I bet they get, if it's a 45 minute respawn was my point. Oh man, I yanked that out too quick. In other words, they could probably get the unique Linux and the Grayling twice. If it's a 45 minute respawn. From the same wall. All right, Richard, thanks for stopping by, man. Appreciate it. Hopefully something something better is on tomorrow afternoon. They respawn, but at the rock, yeah, that's what I figured. That's why I was curious. They'll, we'll see how the leads change around once they start getting their respawns. I'm sure that's a critical part of it. It looks like they might be able to hit 2,800. Can you imagine just being a guy going around like me right now, just trying to find fish? <laughs> They're looking at the score thinking, what in the hell? All right, I got a Linux, but that wasn't really worth that much, was it? I wonder what the score would actually be if a guy that was good had a Linux slash Grayling rotation, what they could get. You think they could get 12 to 1500 without the rock? You would think. If you had a good rotation, I bet you could. That Trovador guy, too. I'm wondering if that's a guy that changed his name. So that's just odd. That guy just starts popping up everywhere. Yeah. Oh, you played it the first time before you knew there was a... Deli was over there cranking the rock. I'm pretty sure Deli's group, though, is the one that told Dave about it. I'm just... I think it backfired, though. I think when Dave put that clip up, I think he was hoping the devs would work on it. Instead more people know how to do it so <laughs> everybody just goes and takes their turn with crank the but again the rewards are so good that i can see why they're doing it holy cow man It was Deli. That's why I figured. I think they were trying to. They probably ended up feeling bad and tried getting them. I don't know why they still haven't fixed this, though. That's insane. I think that's a. What is that? Oh, it's taming. <laughs> I don't want taming. Uh, let's see if I can pull one more out down here. I could have swore I had a Linux mark over here somewhere. Is it here? Burbot. I don't even know how to burbot spot there. There we go. Yeah, he was probably hoping people would stay away from it because I know Dave tries to does his best to do things and not play. He Dave always tries to play legit as well. But yeah, I think that definitely backfired.
But maybe the devs got it on the, uh, when they dropped that new map, maybe they're working on all that stuff at once. Let's hope. It's probably a tough thing to fix, though. If, it, if they're just spawning in that wall, it's probably a tough thing for them to fix, is my guess. Why they haven't fixed it, it's probably not easy. Man, we can't even get a damn pipe, bro. Alright boys, well, we hit 300. I want to look at something too. Okay, let's say I got carried. I was at, what's my, 2240. I was at 2240. We'll see how bad that plane and something like that kills a guy if he was to carry. 2240 is what I'm sitting at. 2240. Alright. All right, I'm probably just going to kill some time at the Congo while I'm waiting for this. Uh, unless there's another custom up. The big fish fly like darts. <laughs> oh. The big fish fly like darts. Best weight match, 374. Uh, why not? Starts in an hour and 16 minutes. How long is this, though? How long is this? Starts an hour and 16 minutes, and it's... 45 minutes. All right. Hour and 16 minutes would be... 3.30 for me. And that one starts at 3. So I could probably get both of those in. Alright, fellas. Let's dump that. Dump that. All right, I'm going to go kill a little time at the Congo for a while. You're going to try the flying dart. All right, I'll have that for later. Actually, let me put... I wonder if that one will do any good on those, probably. I'll try that on that. What else do I got here? For sure. Well, until they release a new map, there's not too much to do, fellas. Let's bring that. All right. All right, let's go fish for some perch, some Cornish Jack, and maybe some tilapia so we're gonna go kill some time doing that while we wait for that other thing to start what's everybody else gonna do anything fun
Happy Tuesday, Tracy. And oh, you're spawning and recipe trialing. Oh, I was going to tell you, Keith, if I didn't already. 66 pounds of good for now perch. Not really, bro. Not really. As there's Fiss and Mako. All right. Let's go for the tiger fish for a couple. We'll just rotate around, boys. I'm going to do a next rotation. I don't want to get too burned out on the perch. So we'll go for a couple tiger fish, then go for a couple perch, go for a couple tilapia, go for a couple cornish. Or whatever we can get to bite, I guess. Oh, Keith, what I was going to say is we should uh, mess around sometime in the uh, on the one of us. Well, I didn't even cast that far enough. What a choder. Um, you need a uni tiger for a monster mission. Perfect timing. Nice. Well, I was going to say, Keith, uh... Now, one of us two have asked. We need to try a crankbait for that. Stop fishing pebbles and rocks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't care, Lucky, if you're on. Are you on PlayStation, bro? One hundred percent. I've been trying. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Try. Uh, that's why I was gonna. I was gonna try the X series crankbait or another crankbait, depending on that peak. I think it might be a little easier not to. What in the? All right, there it goes. It's spinning on me. Yeah, lucky. I'm in a friend zone. If you want to come here, man, it don't matter. All good, buddy. Oh, that was the pig. Oh, that was the nice one, too. What the hell, bro? Come on. That's not him. Can't be. We don't know what he is. Well, there we know it's a Goliath. Unless it's a random combo that suddenly bit a major popper. Oh, that's a baby one. You're only on PC. I'm only on PlayStation. I don't know how guys could keep up with two different platforms. That'd be a lot of work. I don't know. Fishing Planet Mobile might be kind of fun, but I don't I wouldn't have that much time to level up. Keith, do you play Fishing Planet on mobile too? I know Dizzy does. That's why I was going to say, 
I don't have one of those jobs where I could do it either at work, so there, it'd be kind of pointless for me because if, if I was going to play, I could just, in other words, same thing, Keith. If I had the free time, I'd just be on my PlayStation. I can't remember what level it is, bro. You need to just get the leveling up. Tropicana, I think the first one unlocks at, uh, and I actually like the smaller one, to be honest. I want to say the mid-60s. When's the first Tropicana unlock, guys? Probably 65 to 70 somewhere, maybe. Oh, you do play Flana? <laughs> yeah, I I would struggle with it, man. I probably would, man. Yeah, I would struggle on Fish and Planet Mobile, probably. Probably troll to this guy, but I'm being lazy. I want to keep my boat in place. Touch screen would destroy you. <laughs> you struggle. <laughs> yeah, me too, man. That and just the thought of having to level all the way up again, that would be a pain. Oh, uh, Lucky, I don't really re make too many recommendations on purchasing stuff, so uh, I, I, didn't, I don't have the bass boat explore pack i can tell you the ones i liked but I, I don't think i bought that one man i got the congo dlc a long time ago for the boat the, the amazon thing for this boat and then uh i bought a couple other things in the game because i like the skins i got the golden uh what else did i get the golden pack and i think the deluxe pack was the main ones I bought. I, I couldn't tell you if that's a good one or not, in other words. Somebody in the chat might have bought it. All right, there's the uni boys. Took a little while, but we got him out of there. 40,000 XP. Man, I forgot what it's like to have premium. Holy cow. Holy cow, man. I'm not used to having all that extra cash. I don't really need it, boys, but I got premium because I got the premium for the double Bitcoin thing. Go for a couple perks until I get bored. I'm gonna try this. You know what? I won this last week at the Bass Speed Hunt, and I really don't like this thing, man. But I'm gonna try it for a little bit. I was excited when I won this, but I really don't like it yet. I've only used it a little bit, but I haven't noticed anything stellar out of this thing, man. Yeah, it's the same thing. Road Warrior 88 Dash, Lucky. Oh, the peak's high, too. Does that mean they're up higher? Feels like catfish. 
Looks like catfish are hitting me. All right, thanks for trying to help him, Dizzy. I, I didn't get that one. The ammo, uh, I don't know, Lucky. If I were you, I would just grind out the, uh, since you got the Congo, man, grind the hell out of the Congo, and then, unless you just got money burning, whoa, unless you just got money burning a hole in your pocket, I would kind of wait and just level. You can level up here fairly quick, man, if you just grind it out. Holy, that thing yanked that in all the way from over here. <laughs> $76,000. Holy cow, 42,000 XP. That, that, that barely even seemed like work, fellas. Barely even seemed like work. That's an odd size, too, a 416. You know what I like too? I like the little Cornish Jack, man. The Cornish Jack are fun too. You don't like the Cornish Jack, Keith? They're fun. Let me see if I can get one over here. Uh, let me try over here. I want to try this little flat spoon on him. I won this little X Series flat spoon the other day too, so I'm going to try that for a second at least. Where the hell did I put that right here? Okay, I think I'm safe from tiger fish. Um, as long as the room didn't fill up. It's just me. It's me and uh, Ray. Ray's in here with me. Just go over there and go join friends and then go, go right there, man. Yeah, that, well, holy cow. Hold on a second, guys. I just casted that 17 miles. Good grief, bro. Yeah, I used to just, I would do like a, a mixed rotation for the tiger fish and the, uh, and the perch. Just because I think the perch is a little easier. I think the tiger fish are more work, but. I don't know. They're fun. Tiger fish are really fun to catch. Oh, the little African, yeah, they're fun. They put if you put on a, uh, a little jig winner or something, or you could probably go in small. Yeah, the African pike are fun too. Oh my god, I could probably cast it again, bro. This thing's like slinging it, man. I should have set my anchor. You need a good casting rod. You'll find one thing that's weird about the game, Lucky. The casting rods, they don't cast as far. I think there's a couple casting rods I really like in the game, but the Tropicana by far is my favorite. The Sharp Casters are okay. But a lot of them you're going to find, they just don't cast very far. Oh, 
<laughs> Speaking of, look at that. A 6 0. What the hell, Keith? He just talked me into that. What levels? The, oh, man. I, I don't have all that stuff memorized, Lucky. I want to say. Um, hold on. They might. I know I ain't going to have it in the shop. The, uh, the Tropicana. It's probably this one. This is my favorite one, the 710. I want to say. If the Amazon opens up at level 68, it's got to be 68, 68 plus then, right? Or is there one that unlocks a little earlier than the Amazon? I can't remember. I want to say 65 to 70, somewhere in there, level 70, 65, some, give or take, somewhere in there, man. I would have to look at the shop. 60 odd, okay. Your level 52 day. Flano thinks it's 60 something. It has to be 60. What the hell did I just do that for? What do you mean, where am I? I'm at the Congo, bro. I'm at the Congo over here fishing for, uh, fishing for some Cornish. Try not this thing and see if it works or not. I feel like I could have already got a trophy by now with a buzz bait or something, though. What do you mean you can't find me? I'm catching pike on this thing. What in the hell? That's kind of cool, though, but a little odd. I think my lure is look look my lure is almost as big as the fish. <laughs> oh man. Oh, level 58. Okay, it's lower than I thought then, Dizzy. Well, that's good it's that low. I thought it was higher, man. That's good it's that low. Let me put a crack it on here. A little slower to retrieve. You only need eight more levels then, Lucky. It was the tree. What the hell? Level, okay, 710, level 62 for cash, 77. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Dizzy, unfortunately, that's for the Bitcoin version. That's why they're giving it to him early. I was going to say, I thought it was up there higher. Lucky bro, your best advice is to look at the look at your homepage and go to casting rods and they'll tell you exactly what you need to what you be, need to be at. But you need to check the line and everything else too. Cause the weird part about the game is you'll have a rod and reel unlocked, but for whatever reason you gotta get up a level or two just to get the damn line for it. That always drove me crazy. I always felt if you unlock the rod, then the reel and the line should come along at the same level. And there's the unique African pike, boys. 
Off the 6 though. You've seen it here first, boys. Who would have thought you had to use a little lure? <laughs> oh, man. That's not, that's almost $1,000 right there, fellas. Just off that little bitty thing. Okay, we know the African pike like this thing. We got we got a secret weapon, boys. Secret weapon for the African pike here. Think bigger, boys. Who knows about the hook sizes in this game? <laughs> oh man. The comical part of it is a trophy has a trophy Cornish hasn't hit this, but we've already cycled through the African pike. Yes. Uh, the the other one, I just won this one, Keith, but I'm a big fan of the the trophy flat spoon you can get here for those. Yep, the brook trout love that thing. The trophy one as well. The flat spoon. At Moose Lake, yep. The Jacunda, yeah, that's a that's a lot of fun. The Jacuna comp is fun. I would agree. I like that as well. I don't think these things like this thing that much. Oh, yeah, when you get the blocker bass run. <laughs> yeah, those butterfly won't leave you alone. But, hey, it's better than dialing in all the piranha and stuff. All right, one more try at this. If I don't have a Cornish on this damn thing, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw a different spoon that I like for him to see if it's, it could be the peak. I think it's odd that I got an African pike unique before I got a uh, at least a trophy Cornish. That's not him either. What the hell is this? Another pike? I'm pretty sure it is. A trophy pike. Okay, yeah, they love this thing, man. What the hell? That's so odd. So that means they probably like the... Uh, let, me, let me just see if it's a peak. Hold on. This is odd. I don't know what's going on here. I know these things love this little... Let me try this spoon. All right, now, if I don't get a Cornish with this, that means the peak's just different. Could be just a peak. Is my chat that far behind? That's just not a good peak.
that's got to be a tough air better, right? the choke out. A couple more casts for the end. If not, I'll move on to something else. And the darts thing you can use. Uh, uh, you have to look at the details, man. I'm not sure, Lucky. Most people are probably going to be using uh, a shad or a spoon, I would assume. I didn't look. I'm going to have to look myself. I doubt they made it bait. I'll look here in a second, man. Let me see what the details are here on this thing. It says tackle types, uh, crankbaits, jig heads, spoons, spinner baits, pretty much everything. Oh, it's it's lures only for sure though. No bait, no bait, only lures, only lures, man. Hold on one second. Let me try one more thing before I go out of here. Let's try the white one with a ball. Just a glow shot. Is that another pike? Holy pike for days. This is the biggest pike hot spot ever. <laughs> Those things definitely pay good for their size, pound for pound wise. My child is way behind. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's crazy, man. <laughs> well, you guys, see, I, I don't know that I'd ever missed on him there before. That's what's funny. Must be something to do with this peak. Try a generic shad. Do I have a generic? I don't have a generic shad with me anymore, do I? Just the green one and the yellow one. Let's try the green one first. We'll save our power shad for the, the best weight match thing. There's Alex over there. What's up, buddy? I didn't even know you're in here, man. Oh, baby, new meaty fella spot, boys. Just kidding. I've messed on him on her before. Yeah, 8 to 14 is good. I, if I were you, I would start out with 10s. You can get the trophy quicker and stuff, and you'll get a little comfortable with it. If you go all the way up to a 14, it, you'll get mad because a lot of them will miss. So I, I always recommend starting with the 10s. You won't miss quite. And right now, for whatever reason, they have a really bad glitch in the game where your fish fly off. So that's why they were naming it Flying Darts. <laughs> that's why I was laughing about the guy that made the comp up there coming up. Somebody's fish is flying over there. Alex, is your fish flying out of the water, bro? There's your mo oh look at him like a boss pulling in the trophy. Good stuff, Alex. Pretty sure that was another catfish. 
Another cop pass. Another cop pass. Alright, last cast with the grain of my thumb. I'm gonna put on the other one. Dizzy is farming the heck out of some uniques. I didn't. What'd you say? Oh, you see him fly. Yeah, it does all the time. What's up, Kumar? How's your day going, buddy? What's Dizzy using? It's top secret. It's top secret, Lucky. Dizzy don't give out any pointers. My internet shot craps yesterday, Kumar, for about nine hours. <laughs> right, right when I was in the middle of streaming yesterday. Didn't come back on until like nine o'clock last night, man. So I'm back on the grind. We just went and put up uh, a really horrible score in the old... Uh, we played Crank the River for the first time in four months. Didn't go too well. And now we're in here catching uh, catching bait for uh, sharks later. We're going to use these baby, uh, baby perks for some shark later. Now nah, we're just killing time, Kumar. We got a, uh, a best weight match custom sponsored thing we're going to play here in about a half hour. You gotta get a 374 pound unique now perch for a lucky 20 bait coins. Something to do in between, and I think I got Battle of Canique at some point. I was going to say, you're probably, what level are you, bro? You're going to be in a bad way. That's why I was trying to tell you, Lucky, that the, the holdup is uh, the developers, they sell the Congo DLC, but it only gives you a, um, a float and a bottom rod. So the Wild Africa pack, you get the Nile Chaser. <laughs> That's kind of what the big holdup is for everybody. Which one's it decent on? The pike or the, uh, you tried it on the, what was you saying, flannel? I'm sorry, buddy. I walked away for a split second, man.
the deep runners, Trace. If you hold on a second, let me take this off for a second, real quick. Well, I'm thinking the problem is the perts are up a little higher right now, but assuming they're down low, Tracy, or whatever you're going for. The easiest way, I think, is just to do this. But if you can't get a bite like that, depending on what depth, whatever you're going for, then you can just hold up on it. And then just let it float. So in other words, if, if the perch or whatever you're going for is up higher, then you just have to work it really slow. That's what the pain is. Kind of the same thing on the Jacunda. That Jacunda comp you play in, you'll notice if the if the barometer's up, you're gonna want to stay up near the surface normally. We'll see if I can even get one though. My peak's getting ready to wear off too. Yeah, see, because they're up higher. See what I was talking about there? You can get unique and trophy with these. It just takes longer because it's an 8.0. I wish they had a 10.0 version of this. I would love it on Shark even more. You're welcome. Well, I've that's if you guys ever watch my crankbait videos, that's a lot of that's like I said, it's not something you're always just gonna pick up on real quick. I fished a ton for uh, shark and it's so hard to get your timing down, especially on shark. It's not as hard for these these things, but And you normally, there's just better options for the perch as the uh, shad, in my opinion. But the same. Oh, did you like those flannel? Oh, I was hoping that helped out a lot of people. But just like here, you'll see this thing sinks so fast is the problem. If it was a shallower one. So in other words, you could get a bite, technically speaking. You can just do this and get a bite. But the same thing if you're playing in that jacunda. And if you notice that barometer's up. You're going to be doing the same thing right here, whether you want to hold your rod tip up and just hold it up like that so it auto hook sets. You can just sit and do it like this if you wanted. Hey, Scully, what's up, buddy? But I have more fun when they're down deep with this one, but that's basically the moral of it. Just go like that if you wanted. Adjust your speeds accordingly, but the trouble is you got the current too. But this is also, whoops, see, he hit it on the fall that time. This is also a crazy good lure to troll with as well. This is more here, I would think, for these would just be, if you're just trying to get a steady bite with them, but you're not going to get the, uh, the uniques as quick as you would on a shad. Is that the other thing getting restarted? Okay, guys, we took 68th place trying to do that traditional manner. That is not the way to go, boys. That is not the way to go. And these guys hit all the way up. Did they hit 3,000? Nope, but they got way up there. They got way up there. All right, guys, I got about 13 minutes for this thing here. What time does this one start? Oh, no, we got 30 minutes. Holy cow, man. That's going to be... Is that 37? I forgot. Uh, I'd be going in there late. 
I wonder if I should just go get Battle of the Kinnik done and then come back. I might do that real quick. Gonna do some speed fishing. Hold on, let me see if I can get this to work or not. Hold on. I don't know if I can get any of them off the bottom, but let me try. This is a really good lure to troll with too, but I don't know if I can get him with the, uh, the barometer up so high. Yep. See that? I just trolled that one in. Did you guys see what I did there? It's a little one, but it's a fish. Oh, that's a... <laughs> that would almost have been good for the Nile Emperor, fellas. Just trolling through there like that. All right, guys, give me one second. I got to get a drink, guys. I'll be right back. Are you guys going to try to do that lucky, uh, lucky in all parts thing or no?
for sure. I forgot to look and see what peak it is, but I'm sure he picked a good peak, probably. Lucky, be careful over there, bro. There's, t I'm going for tiger fish right here. There's not perch. In the event you have, uh, you don't have a leader on, bro. Tiger fish will bite you off, man. They are very cruel. Oh, they're, wow, my Goliath are even flying now. Well. I know that you didn't used to be a thing. Obviously, they'll miss the lure, but they do not fly off Fishing Planet. They never did, used to. Oh, a flying Vondu? That's hilarious. I don't know if my cat, I've ever seen my catfish fly, but that doesn't surprise me, man. Uh, what are you, they like as little as 4-0 all the way up to 10-0, believe it or not, man. The tiger fish aren't real picky, in my opinion. 4-0 to 10 -0, buddy. Atta boy, Alex. I think our peak's about burnout, too. Uh, we'll try a couple more casts.
flying off still. Thanks, Jelly Jam. I hope you're having a good day too, man. Whoa, we almost spit the hook. All right, I think that makes, yeah, we'll do two more casts. If the unique don't hit, we'll go for a perch. Spike. this forever. I have not used the old duck lure forever. I know they like to miss it. Like that. They're very good at missing this thing. Again. We definitely need a Seminole. The, per the perch fake bite. <laughs> yeah. That's what it feels like sometimes. I remember when I first did this mission, I was so excited to get this, but. Oh, there we go. I just miss it so often. big common to hit that thing. Oh, 
Last try. I don't know, catch a person. I probably should get set up for the Kanik thing as well. Oh, hold on. Did that thing already start? Wait a second. Hold on a second. I thought that thing started it. No, it starts in 11 minutes. Okay, that starts at 3.30. That takes us to 4.15. I'll have just enough time to get into the other... Uh, that's only a half hour. Hold on a second, guys. That starts. Okay, yeah, that'll be perfect. Then I can do that, and then that'll almost be over, and then I can do that. Oof, that was a little one, I think. Pretty sure that was a little one. some equipment repairs too here in a second. Somebody was asking me the other day, did they, does, does anybody know when the new club series is starting? Somebody was asking me the other day and I had no idea. Did they even announce that yet? Oh, just after the ocean update? Okay. Fake bite still on a 12 out. Well, I wish this one would have fake bit. This one's not even very big. Sometimes I like it when they just bounce off Alex and if you can just go like a common trophy and a unique, it just makes things a lot quicker. Alex, you ever tried trimming your, uh, your rig leader? Like trim your leader down to uh hold on, I was just a guy was just asking me the other day that. I think Alex I do mine around seventeen inches, but you I wanna say it was I did that for a guy the other day to ask me. I wanna say it's around forty three centimeters or forty four centimeters to get around seventeen inches. Okay, it's at fifty. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good, good. A guy had asked me the other day on PlayStation, I messaged him that. There he goes. Good fish, bro. That's some big, that's some big XP for him. He might have shot up a level on that one, didn't he? I seen that lucky good stuff, buddy. That a boy. Yeah, I was gonna say that should shoot you up, man. Dizzy, can you imagine coming here back in the day if you were like level forty? <laughs> How quick your levels go up after what we used to have to do. <laughs> Back in the day, we used to have to sit and farm sturgeon when you were level 40. Over and over, 500 XP at a time. <laughs> Can you guys remember that? 500 and 500 and 900 XP for sturgeon back in the day. Holy cow, man. 
Back in the good old days, right, boys? You started at level 28. <laughs> Wait, Alex, now what? You started at the Congo at level 28? <laughs> Two levels of one uni. <laughs> Alex, you didn't get to live the grind, the old sturgeon grind. <laughs> oh man, hours upon hours a guy took to unlock that green boat. <laughs> oh man, for sure, a lot quicker. <laughs> oh no, if the Congo would have been available back in the day, I definitely wouldn't have put myself through this, the torture of the sturgeon over there on Hamburger Island or whatever we call it. I really don't want to damage this reel right before going into that thing, but I guess I can. I need to go back to the lobby too, guys, here in a second. All right, our net is full. What could we throw away here? We're sitting at 1692, so we could throw away something for 130. What the hell do I got? Do I got one of those little perch in here somewhere? I could throw away that, because that's pretty much almost... Oh, that's a uni. What the hell? Let's throw away... That's 21,000 or 116. 130. No, that would be 11478. Twenty one thousand or let's throw that away. And don't I have a baby perch in here somewhere? Thought I had a baby perch in here, a fifty pounder somewhere. Let's throw that away. It's gonna be close, right? Yes, perfect. Alright. Nineteen hundred pound net boys. Let's get the hell out of here. Nineteen hundred pound payday. Four hundred thousand dollars, cha-ching! Now that's a premium net, boys. And we even had some African pike in there, boys. You know they took up a lot of space. All right. Okay, I need to have my thetus at some point. Thetus. Thetis, Thetis, Thetis. Where is the Thetis? 204K with no premium. Yep. Well, I got the deal for the bait coins. That was the only reason I had the premium. My buddy Josh had got me a thing for my birthday that I had in my wallet. So I went ahead and got the kayak thing. So that I could get double the bait coins. But uh, let me see here. Let's heal that up. This is for Battle of the Kanik, so let's take that off. My rod's kind of damaged, but we'll be all right. All right, I need to get that off there, get a rig back on. Actually, let me just do it this way, be quicker. Perch Daddy. All right, trim that down. Oh, hold on, what hook size do we want? We need a 374. I'm going to go 12s. I'm going to go 12s, boys. We're going to run 12s because we'll need a 374 for that thing. Okay, on top of that, I'm going to need for the Battle of the Canique is... That's that that's a little blackfish, right, boys? A little blackfish, so we need a little feeder rod. Put on the Eyed Killer for that one. We're going to want a number 16. Six 70-pounders? Great. <laughs> I'll go into that right after this perch thing. I think I'll have just enough time to get in there, so. Yeah, it figures. We know how that goes, boys. I'm not counting on much in that one. Do I even have a 16 with me? Yeah, I do. All right, now I need some caddis larva. I thought, what the hell? Oh, I was going to do the burbot yesterday. 
and my internet crashed. That's why I had that in there. Seventy-seven. Holy cow! <laughs> oh, you're setting up for the top. Your birthday's in seven days. Well, happy early birthday, Lucky. Happy early birthday, man. I do that, Keith, on the uh, salmon galore and the uh, whatever. I'll make that mistake. They they get confusing, right? All right, let's see here. That one, okay, this one starts. The big fish fly like darts. I like it. The big fish like darts. Oh, the big fish. I thought he said fly like darts. The big fish like darts. The big fish like darts. Okay, best weight match is 374. That looks like a sunny peak, low pressure. So... That's for that. I don't want that on there, though. Sunny Peak. Uh, we'll start. We'll try the stupid thing because I have it. If I if I don't like it, we'll use something else. But oh god, it's already starting. Let's go, boys. We can't mess around anymore, fellas. We gotta get in here. Got 45 minutes to catch up. A Nile Perch is a lucky, lucky comp here. Guy's going for a 374. For sure. Just for the boat? It sounds like a plan, bro. That's why I got it. Well, it's going to come with... Uh, the cool part is... Um, lucky, you'll get, the, you'll get a couple of these too, man. You'll get some Tropicanas with that as well. They do come with the Tropicanas. That Amazon thing. And then later on, if you want, you can sell them and get bait coins out of them because there's no difference. It just says SE on it. All right, boys. Good luck here. We're not going to the Battle of Canique. We're going to the Big Fish Like Darts. Here we go. Oh, God. Oh, God. Is it the peak that I think that he picked? This guy's evil. This guy's evil, whoever picked this peak, if it's the same. <laughs> no. Just have fun with it, Lucky. You never know, buddy. It's just a Lucky comp, man. You just need one Lucky fish, bro. Oh, God, this guy is evil. Look, look at the... Look at the peak. Oh, man. This is not a good peak. This is going to be brutal, boys. Somebody will get some good luck in it. Good luck, Lucky. You never know, buddy. I'm going to try a 12 -0. If that don't work, we might do 11. We'll see how small they are. 374. That's kind of small. Two thousand bitcoins on it. Uh oh. I think we've all made those weird expenditures on here, Dizzy. Don't feel bad, bro. Oof. There's my perch. Did you see that perch? Oh my god, dude, that was perfect. I could have got that on clip. Damn. That perch flew a mile. You can use bait? Uh, I think I looked at that, bro. I don't think you can. Let me double check. It says tackle types. No, bro. You can't. You can only use you can only use this stuff. Nope. There's no minnows or anything on there, buddy, unless I'm it says minnows. That that means it's not the large minnows like you're thinking, bro. That's for the deep runner. Oh, you did, Alex?
One or two. <laughs> I did... Mine was on lures, and then I didn't realize until you scroll the page over. Like, they trick you because you have something unlocked, and you get the getting the, getting a lure, and then you realize you scroll over, and it wasn't for bait coins if you just leveled up a little higher. <laughs> it got me a couple times. Uh, the NE, you mean the SE stuff? If I understand you correctly, Flynn, are you talking, you mean the special edition things? Man, I really didn't want to destroy my reel this quick. The night edition rods. Oh, the glow in the dark. I only have, I didn't buy any of that stuff. The only one I have is the, uh, Ezra might be able to help you out more. Um, the one you got from Halloween. I didn't purchase any night edition rods. I do have that one, or I might have two. Whichever ones you can get from the, uh, the Halloween event. The one that you can earn naturally. Son of a biscuit, bro. Ah, that's on a 12 o y'all. Do I go to 11? I don't think I have an 11 with me, man. I don't have an 11 with me. I don't have an 11. I don't want to go to 10. That's way too small. You're welcome. The one I like, it looks really cool. I can't remember. There's a, there's a, uh, it's a casting rod. It looks really awesome. But now that you said that, there's some of those that look really cool. Oh yeah, for sure, Keith. That's when I was getting the 370s. <laughs> oh man. If I get another one that's in a 400s, I'll go down to a 10 0. If my next one's a 400, I'll go to 10 0. Wow, you didn't even see. Let's see here. Maybe it was the X Series Shad. Gave it a little extra. I swear the other day when I first won this, I went and messed with this thing, and I was not getting anything good with it. Maybe I didn't give it enough chance. I'm bad at that. Trying to lure out for a little bit, and then you don't really like it. I think it's that club series. That club series shot is amazing, though. That glow-in-the-dark one. We're tossing it. Alex, how are you in fourth and you haven't even caught a fish yet? Hacker. Oh, that one just flew off. Where is that fish at? Come on now. He's <laughs> stuck now. Oh, uh. Oh, hell, you're already in the top five, and you didn't even do anything, bro. I don't stand a chance against Alex, this guy. What in the hell is this? The little common that could? Yep, I know he was. We knew he was. Let's cast away over there and then try to troll back into position here. 
Maybe we'll get something on the way. That's when you're lazy, when you don't want to start your engine, boys. Waiting for my boat marker. Where is my boat marker? Did I lose my boat marker? Dude, I don't remember being back this far. Right on top. Oh, there it is. Oof, that was a nice one. What do we got up there? Everybody's too missing on the high side, looks like. Everybody is missing on the high side. I wonder how close somebody will get. So I got about two. Didn't I play one of these not too long ago and did the 9-0? I can't remember what the hell I was doing. I don't know if I like this shed. Oh, Josh was telling me that. Yeah, Dizzy, I need to go back over there and play that sometime, man. I was thinking that the other day. Uh, somebody said no on that. I'm pretty sure. Guys, Flano was asking... Trolling only is going to be at the, the ocean map, right? They're not going to let you troll at the existing maps or the pre-existing maps. I'm pretty sure I asked somebody that and they said no. I don't remember who the hell it was, but I did ask that. Okay, there's a trophy. That usually means it's going to take me 75 minutes to get the uni out. Oh, that it might be available for the other maps in the future, but not, not right at the start then. That would make sense. So maybe Flano, after they uh, release that ocean map, maybe eventually they'll add it to the other ones. Oh, 
I know I used to, uh, well, here I, well, a lot of people's probably done it. I used to do it here with the, uh, the crankbaits and stuff. Well, yeah, the Amazon. Same with the boat buddy thing. Ah, gotcha. So even you could fish with your buddy on a boat at the other maps eventually. That'll be cool. But yeah, even at Blue Crab, I would, uh, Blue Crab would be fun too, Flano. Because I, I used to throw my buzz bait out there and go backwards for the tarpon just with my trolling motor. With the buzz bait on top of the water, it was so much fun. But yeah, I don't know why they don't just let us troll. I can get this one out of here. I might go down to that 10 or 9-0. I just want to see if I can get this out of here. Oh, that's not him. That can't be him. That was too small of a bite. What do you mean I don't know where to go, Lucky? What, uh, do you know how to, uh, you probably don't know how to share marks, man. I can give you my marks, bro, but you have to send me a mark first because it takes me too long to send them to you because my friend list is so long. Is this the... Is that him? He didn't even hit like a uni. Well, he's tearing the hell out of my reel. Bro, easy on the reel. I think that's him. 374. Hit us with a 374. Just kidding, boys. We don't want to take first name it. We don't really need anything. We're doing this for fun. We'll take a 380, though. Give us a 380. Keep us in a top 10. Is that a... What the... Oh, my God. We're downgrading. Another 400. All right. Downgrading. That did not get us any closer. We don't want to get too close, though. Should we do a 10 or a 9? I think 11 would have been the spot, to be honest. A 10 or 11. But I'm going to go 9 and go smaller for the third spot. And yes, Keith, the Super Dave thing the other day would have been great since that was a 415 and I got a 412 and a 414. I, I think I did get all 370s in that one. <laughs> oh, man. We'll try a 9 -0. My guess is I'll probably catch common and a trophy. And if I get a unique, it'd probably be like a 360-ish. I'm going to get a lot of commons, though. Oh, I did not see it. That is hilarious. I did on a 12. That, or what was I fishing with, bro? Do you remember, Dizzy? I think I was using a 13. I was using a 13, too. <laughs> You're right. It was a 374 because I had to sort my net. I remember now. I wasted it. Way to go, Dizzy. I shouldn't have went for that last perch. My net was full. I didn't have to be a greedy pig. All right. We got the trophy combo. What's that count for? Nothing? Uh, let's throw that away because the odds are our net's probably going to get filled. So let's don't use that.
Yeah, you're right. It was a 374. That's funny. But yeah, Dizzy, we definitely need to play the angler. Josh was telling me, I'm so far behind in that, man. I would need a lot of people's help. I have not played that. I don't think I've played that for three months now, the angler. I would literally be lost. I, I played, it, played it briefly after the, uh, the Spain map opened up. I would need a lot of guidance. Yeah, I haven't even used the bottom rod or bought a bottom rod or anything. Looks like I'm on the catfish, though, fellas. Holy cow, man. We might have to go 10 us. We are tearing the catfish apart. All right. Who's close up there? Oleg, Gizzy, and Sewer Rats. Oh, we'd have to help one another for sure then. I know my buddy Al Boo plays that one. He, he's pretty good guiding, guiding me on that one. All right, we're going to have to do an angler stream, boys, at some point here. It looks like I'm noodling for these things, right? <laughs> Might have to work that up off the ground a little bit here. It is my fault. The trouble is right now it's showing that the perch should be at the bottom Unfortunately, so are the catfish. You're on seventh. Well, you better keep casting, Alex. You need to be top three for the bait coins. I'm sure everybody's low on bait coins right now after the St. Patty's Day thing. <laughs> oh, man. Kidding, fellas. Everybody's probably loaded up with a whole pile of bait coins. Is this another, if this is another catfish, we are going to 10th. I know, I was kidding. That's why I'm doing it for fun, too. The white match ones are always fun. I don't know if the 9 is the way to go. All right, last try. I'm not kidding, fellas. Last try at the 9 -0. It's just a thought I had. I kind of figured we'd catch a bunch of small ones. Oh, pretty good, Dodge. How's your day going, man? We're trying to catch a 374-pound perch here in this lucky comp. It's a best weight match. We got a 414 and a 412. So we, we downgraded from a 12 to a 9 All right, let's make two changes. Let's get off the... Uh, the X series rip shot it wasn't too bad though. What was that a yeah, four fourteen and a four twelve. So let's let's go to a ten o and change our shad here. Yeah. Well, I to be be honest, I don't I don't want to get too lucky, man. Somebody might be needing the bait coins. I Dutch, you know as well as I do, I got up to that four thousand bait coin mark from that St. Patty's Day thing, so I'm fine. I'm fine if I don't get top three. I'm just looking to have fun. And what's funny, Dutch, is I was farming uh, in free mode a second ago, and I didn't realize it, but Dizzy told me I caught one that was 374 in free mode. <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention. That's what's funny. It was my last fish I just caught before I entered this thing. All right, well, we're straight on. Oh, I went to a 12 and not a 10. What the hell am I doing? Oh, and you got up to your 6K? Awesome. Yeah, you won't have to worry about anything for a while. You won't have to worry about anything for a while, but maybe we'll just skip the 12 on. Just let, let fate decide. They seem to be liking the 12-0 today. Maybe it was the X-Series rib shad that were bringing them in the 400-pounders. I doubt it, folks. I doubt it. Oh, my God. These guys are going to kill me. 
was no. Can I throw this away? Hold on. Is this a dip? Because I will literally throw it away. I really didn't want to win. That would be so rude. Is this a keep? <laughs> These guys are going to hate me. <laughs> These guys are going to hate me. <laughs> uh, should I throw it away? Hold on. Let me see something for now. These guys are going to hate me. Oh, rude. Hold on. Let me see here. <laughs> Hold on. Can I... I've... <laughs> I'm going to get a bunch of hate mail. You know what's funny is I had a guy the other day leave something on my channel. Believe it or not. I, I'd have to... I don't know what video it was. He left a, He left a thing and said that I wish people like you weren't greedy and wanting up all the awards. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure on the fishing planet I've showed all kinds of marks and helped people on competitions the best I can. And I am not greedy or something. Some guy had said that actually. So I was sitting there thinking, now that I've caught this, these guys are like, you win everything, Road. Oh. oh, no, it's catch. It's not keep. I can't even throw it away, guys. Damn. Oopsie. <laughs> oh, man. Well. There's our third one. Now we need to... <laughs> oh, man. All right, boys. It was a 12 -0. It, it, boys, it actually was. If I was, no, I'm not kidding. If I was the target in that size range, I would do a 10-0 or 11-0. I, I swear. <laughs> I would have did a 10-0 or 11-0 if I was really, really trying. <laughs> yeah. Dot says just keep it and take their bait coins. I'm sure nobody's hurting for bait coins. Surely not. There's no way. Yeah, no, I, I literally was just looking to come and have fun. Hopefully somebody beats me. Surely they can. Somebody else has got 18 minutes, guys. Now get up there and get you some. All right, we'll go 13-0. I don't want to get any closer, boys. We don't want to stay with the that lucky 12. No, I would have. Honestly, I think 11-0 would be perfect for the 370 to 380 range. If, if. Hook sizes actually work like that. Now, you guys know earlier I was throwing the X Series flat spoon. I just won 6 0 and I was catching African pike. And, and I not just one African pike. I want to say I got six African pike off a of 6 0 earlier. And we know those fish are small. So who knows? But yeah, if a guy was the target, you would think a 10 0, 11 0 would be uh, ideal for the 370 range.
Pretty sure this is the trophy. Uh, I'm waiting for it to ramp over this rock. I remember when my buddy Dutch sent me a video. <laughs> Dutch, you remember when you sent me that video of that flying perch you had? <laughs> On your line? That was insane. I think we're going to have to let this one tire himself out, fellas. I don't know. Hell, it's just trying to be a cheapskate. The moon parts, yep. No, I'm not trying to get close. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. I'm just going to probably have to throw this away later, but we'll put him in there for now. $39,000. Man, I forgot what it's like to have premium. That's just a lot of money, man. Dude, I don't know where that flew to. That was a hog. Whatever the hell that was. Well, Alex and Dizzy and whoever else is playing in this, how's it looking? Keith. Oh, that one charged me. That's not him. Oh, they force fed him. <laughs> Seventy seven pounder, huh?
Marcio Costa. I haven't seen him forever, man. I wonder what he's been up to. That might be him. Feels heavy. Can't tell for sure. Surface, big guy. What do you got in your hair? On 10 -0? I don't know what's happening to you. That... I don't even know, Alex. The, uh... <laughs> My buddy Zat, he has the worst... He was so mad the other... Uh, I want to say three or four weeks ago. I think Keith will remember. He was trying to play in the Nile Emperor one long and one short. And every fish that he tried to hook literally flew off. And he ended up quitting the comp. <laughs> All his flew off. It was so bad. <laughs> Spartacus. Spartacus wants me to make a video. I think I had one not too long ago with the Lucky Fish. That's why I feel bad. <laughs> I genuinely feel bad. I didn't want to take. I didn't want to take first, guys. I really didn't. Because I think a 10-0 or 11-0 should have been ideal. I mean, I wanted to get like a 380-ish, but I didn't. Holy, okay, dude. Does anybody else love the waterfall? Oof. A 413. Okay, what the hell? I'm just going to start dumping stuff. Uh, two, well, I have no choice. Now, that's what you call net, boys. That's four unique and two trophy. Look at all the money there. Uh, well, a quick math. Hold on, guys. I was looking at the $75,000, though. Whew. Well, what do we do now? Go fish for tiger fish. Do 
Should we tag our fish to last? Uh, <laughs> should we tag our fish? Oh, man. I say we tag our fish, boys. Uh, what in the hell? Oh, never mind. Hold on. Boy, I'm in the wrong spot. This is my other perch spot. What the hell am I doing? That's my top secret perch spot right there. <laughs> I'll try not to get a uni. Let me. Should I nerf myself with a club series topper? <laughs> club series. Hold on. Let me try this thing on him. <laughs> yeah, that that was. There's a lot in there. This is not really a good peak for him either, to be honest. This is a crappy peak for these things too. Normally. I think they just gave me the, the good RNG for whatever reason. I think they felt bad for me. I know what it was. It was the crank the river I went and did and took 90th place. They felt bad for me since I went and tried to play crank the river the legit way and caught 300 points of fish when everybody else had 2,500. No, I'm nerfing myself, guys. I don't want a unique Goliath. I'm just... I do have a 4-0 on. If I thought I'd thrown the 6-0 out there, you know what I mean? Business. Oh, that one flew. Let's see if I can... I wouldn't mind get the XP though. Dude, that was a hog. Did you see that? That was the uni. I swear that was the uni. Not this one. The one that missed that was a uni. <laughs> Dude, I almost would have got that in, too. That would have been close, fellas. Ha, <laughs> ha. 
I don't know. I don't know, Flano. I don't know. Or no, hold on, Fannin. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, bro. At first, I thought it meant... I thought they were making fun of the game, having a little fun with it. I thought at first I could have swore I read the big fish fly like darts. I thought it was making fun of the fish that were flying around. That's what I thought it was doing, but... I guess it wasn't. I thought it meant the, uh, the making fun of the fish glitching out, but it just said the big fish like darts. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea, man. Oh, God, I'm going to get stuck too, aren't I? I need a... Uh, what the hell do I need to do? We need to go try to catch a big salmon somehow, but that's not going to happen. We know better than that. So let me get this on here. That off of there. That on here, and I'm gonna try that. Uh, I'm gonna try that new X Series flat spoon I got too, fellas. Not that it's gonna matter. We will not catch a 70 pound salmon, that I assure you. That will not happen. Thanks, Ezra. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it, man. You know what was odd about that though. I caught a 412, a 413, and a 414, and then a 374. That was odd. Definitely odd. But what was even more odd is I caught a 374 before I went into the uh, that thing, too. Give me one second, guys. Let me get another drink of water real quick. I'll be right back, and we'll get ready for this Moose Lake. Or Moose Lake. <laughs> Moose Lake. We're going to Kanik, guys. We're going to Kanik. We know where we're going. Battle of Kanik, guys. Good luck if you guys have not been in there yet. All right, we got two more here. We got, how much time do I got here? I got 11 minutes to spare for that one. No, don't freeze me. It's going to freeze me, guys. Don't do it, please. Actually, that might be a good time for a reset. Reset it. Nope. It didn't. All right, here we go. All right, guys. Let me make sure I did have larva. All right, guys, here we go. How bad will this be? Probably pretty painful, right? Dizzy already informed me somebody's got a 77 pounder, so that's probably not a good thing. Not a good thing to find out when you're going into this. All right, boys, we're going to need it. He wasn't lying. Holy, look at the board. Oh, Pac-Man's up there, though. Hold on a second, fuzz. Let's see. All right, let's see here. Pac-Man has got a 76-pounder. Nice. Good stuff, buddy. All right, let's see if we can get this little guy out here. Then... And it's showing high pressure, so they're probably midwater on the salmon. Let's hope. All right, let's see how long this takes us. I got the over and under at two minutes. Let's hope. Maybe three. Or less. 
less. Is that him? We'll take him. We can get smaller, but I don't think it'll matter right now. We'll go for a smaller one, only if it makes sense to you guys, as usual. All right, let's try this for fun. Hold on a second. I hope to God I didn't put that. All right, here we go. Whoa, that's sinking click. They like the trophy flat spin, so let's hope they like this one. this thing seems so heavy now it didn't seem that heavy earlier oh it's the current oh that was not him dude they gotta be up higher surely they're up higher but right there right no? Okay, we had a hit. Is it going to be one of these rounds? Maybe they don't like this lower. I don't think it's the lower. It can't be. cast with this if I don't have at least a trophy on we're abandoning ship on this one get up there So weird. All right, last cast. I don't know why this one wouldn't work. It has to work. Oh. Mm. 
That's not him. At least we got back. Okay, I'll try one more after this. A coho? Tom. Interesting. Why the hell did I just throw that away? So it's like the Coho are hitting them, but the Chinook aren't. That's so odd. Oh, that was a big hit. Uh, should I do one more? Alright. I lied, fellas. One more. One more cast. Whenever I pick up a new X-Series gear, I usually try to try it for a couple of things that might make sense, and that's why I'm trying to stick this out for a little bit. <laughs> that means two more for sure. Well, okay, guys, we'll go until I get an empty cast. As soon as I get an empty cast, we'll dump this lure out. I just figured I'd try. Why not? It's not like the odds are already stacked against this, fellas. I mean, look at the board. A 77, 76, 75, 75, 74, and we're getting chum. Oh, man. Does anybody else find that odd though? It's only been chum. Never mind. That's not a chum. I remember in the Christmas Giants tour when I made the, the semis, I was the only guy using Athedius. I wish I was real shredding back then though. Is that a baby uni or a giant trophy? I love 61 pounders. I love them. <laughs> Ooh. All right, boys. Nothing shocking about this lure. Okay. What the hell? Though? Let me see something. What do I got with me here? Do I got it? I'm going to try something briefly. We're going to do that. We're going to do... What's my smallest Texas rig? Oof. Carolina 44, that will not work. I got a 60 pounder. That actually matches up. Let me try. What's up? Okay, we got it. Uh, let's see. What do you think, boys? Six seventh? Can I cast that far enough, you think? I'm going to try my other X series thing. Meaning I just won this rib shot, fellas. Bear with me. We're going X Series 9-0. And we're going to rock out down here at the bottom with this. For better or worse. Let's try it. Guaranteed 70 pounder. What do you guys think? No? Boys, we are in. We, we st hold on. I forgot to look at that earlier. I forgot. Care to see? Hey, they better. It better be. I'm gonna have a lot of bounce off. Okay, look, boys. 
I was tw my personal rating. If I if I did care earlier when I did crank that river, I was 22 and 40. I lost 22 points on that crank the river doing that traditional man. 20 that that takes so long to get points up. <laughs> uh, man. In other words, I stand to lose another. Uh, I'll be down in the. I'm gonna lose like 50 personal points today, guys. It's very depressing. I'm kidding, guys. I don't care. I just think that's comical, though. I think that's why those guys get so stressed out about placing. Those poor guys that are trying to stay up there in the top 100. Alright, should I try the... <laughs> What'd you raise me with? Oh, you got a 57? <laughs> oh, JL, you know you love the 50-pounders. I've caught a, uh, or no, hold on. My buddy Josh one time. I think my buddy Josh got a 45 and a 47 once in this. <laughs> All right, we're going to grind this for a while, fellas. We might as well just grind it to the end. What happened? Who cares? What's the worst happens? We get 80th place. Oof. Oh, hold on. I need to try my leader. That's my damn problem. And Keith's got a 66 down there. Old MBF Keith. Not Keith, Keith. 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 Let me turn this leader a little bit here. Boom, boom, boom. I got a video somewhere on my channel. I did get, I did get a 75 pounder or 74 pounder before on a, on a 90, but I think it was the glow shad. I want to say it was a three inch glow shad. It wasn't in the actual comp though. It's just in free mode testing stuff out. And obviously they will bounce the hell off of a 9 0 quite often. I don't know if I like the sex or shad though. I have yet to get a bite. Holy man, I can't, if I put on another, if I put on any lighter, <clears throat> I'm not going to be able to cast it very far. Just to be honest, I could probably just cast it right here anyway. Two more casts. If I don't get a bite, we'll try a different shad. Thought that I haven't got a bite yet. Should I put a nymph on? Try Twitch. I can't believe at least a crazy coho didn't try to get it.
Hmm. Let's see if we get any interest in this now. Now, if I get a bite, even if I don't catch a fish, we'll know it was a shad, because I gave it ample time to get a bite. Okay, I got a bite. I missed it by a mile, but... Another bite. Okay, they did not like the X-Series shad. They're bouncing the hell off this club. That's three. I know you guys aren't seeing them, but I promise. I felt small, though. Oof, another hit. Another hit. That's got to be a sock out right there, though. Try a real and twitch. Ooh, I don't think that's him. That's a nice fish, though. Hard to tell because I'm on an offset hook. It's not going to bounce like it would off a jig head or a spoon. Unicoho or Trophy Chinook? What do you guys think this is? It's going to fight different because I got a rig on. Unicoho? That's a coho. Pretty sure it's a coho. I don't know, bro. I think it might be a coho. Yeah, I've got I've got him on a mouse lure before jail. Oh, it might be a Chinook, bro. That's a 66 pounder too. Well, there you go, boys. Didn't get any bigger though, really. There we go, off a offset 9-0. I mean, what do I do? Throw a 12? Maybe that's it, offset 12-0, boys. <laughs> that was on a real on Twitch, too, oddly enough. If you guys caught how I caught that. Just a straight retrieve with a Twitch. Manual Twitch, I should say. Well, boys, that was fun. That's over with. We can't get a third one. So... That's all she wrote. Should I have a battle of the small? <laughs> no. No, we're not going to go for the blackfish, fellas. It's, hold on. Unless JL's up there. JL, what did you say you had? Who could I knock down here if I get a smaller fish? Battle of the smalls, fellas. Oh, I could knock Lee R down a little bit. No, I couldn't. No, I couldn't. Oh, if I got the .22... I could knock him down there a little bit. What's he got for it? He gave up and didn't care. He left. All right, boys.
That looks like that's it. We can't catch anything else. How much time do I got for this thing? 19 minutes, huh? Well, should we go back and farm some more at the Congo? Let me go get set up for this other thing. Or hold on here, let me finish that. Alright, we got our two. We got our two. The the vampire mouse, uh, JL, if you've never tried it, the vampire mouse looks decent in that. Next time you're throwing the duck, <laughs> might, might as well. I normally used to experiment at the bottom no matter what. If you got your one at the top, do something different at the bottom just for the hell of it. You never know, man. I think it's just random RNG, though. I've never placed in that one. I, the one time I got a 74 or 5-pounder, there was three people ahead of me that had one bigger. I don't know if I'll ever place in that one, fellas. I don't think it's a thing for me. All right, we got that set up, but I'm not using that. I thought about doing something different, too. Or not real different, but I did think about running the... Uh, I could use the old traditional, which... I thought about doing the Leprechaun this time in a bass speed hunt just for fun. Since I know a lot of people probably have that now. Oh, you're in a hundredth. Ouch. Yeah, that'll, like I said, that's not a comp if you care about you. Most of the time you won't see the top players playing in that just because if you guys noticed earlier when I did really bad, I had 2240. See what happens to these guys uh, if people that care about their 100 standings or whatever. Now, obviously, if I was a bag dumper and only played in certain comps, I could be in the top 100 by now. But for those guys that care about their personal rating, uh, they have one bad finish like that. It literally destroys destroys your points. So for these guys, it's hard for them to play in the uh, some of those lucky comps because it'll shred their uh, personal already. Like that one there is probably going to knock me down another 15 or so, probably. Let's see here. Pair of 68s, I would, well, why didn't you give me one, Keith, you pig? You could have saved one for your friend. I got stuck with the real small ones, bro. All right, I'll probably, I don't know what I'm going to do. I might, I thought about turning that thing. Let me bring another reel just in case. And what the hell's up with this rod, bro? This thing's smashed. I thought I had another theater. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, I had three. What the? Oh, I know why I had those. Hey, Christopher. How you doing, sir? How's your day going, buddy? Oh, you'd rather be greedy and take nine from one. I see how you are. Well, I see how you are. Leave me down there with the 66 and the 61. Alright, that'll be good for that. And I got that for that. I don't really need an extra reel, do I? Nah, I'll be alright. Alright, so let's uh hold on one second. Let me fill this up though. Nope, yeah, for sure. <laughs> well, we know JL's got uh he's thinking he's gonna be a hundred and fifth place or something, so at least we didn't do that bad. Poor jail. Where the hell is it? Man. You know what I wish they'd add to Fishing Planet, at least for console? I wish you had like a favorite list, like an inventory inside your inventory. So like if you wanted to keep your most used reels, in a certain area, like another tab, so you didn't have to stroll through 7,000 things to find what you're looking for. <laughs> Does anybody else wish that was a thing? 
like you could keep your Krakens and your uh, giant spins and everything else in a certain spot instead of having to go through all this stuff. Just to find your one spare giant spin, wherever the hell it is. I have no idea. I can't find it. There it is. Yes, and the line. The line's the worst. <laughs> the line will make me dizzy going through it because I try to spin through it so fast. All right, let's see. I thought I had one of these that are damaged. So there's this one. Cold summer has well and truly gone. Uh, where, where are you at, Christopher? We're just now getting ready to start spring, but it was cold this morning, man. Our spring's just getting ready to start here, about three weeks away, I think. All right, guys, it looks like I've got. Uh, Got about 13 minutes, so since I still got premium, I'm going to go through and, not that I need it, but I'm going to go through and get some more. Uh... Oh, you're in South Australia. All right. Oh, man, that's awesome, Christopher. That's one of the uh, places I've always wanted to visit, believe it or not. I think more so, uh, is that near Sydney? I would love to go to Australia, man, for real. I'm not even joking. That'd be a cool place to visit, I think, for sure. Let me see here. Where's that? All right, let's try the. Uh, I want to try that flat spin on the. I would assume it works all right, but let me go try anyway. Since I just want to. So I want to mess around with that. And what else was we going to do? Something else. think they bought it but I was gonna try Alrighty. oh yeah that is another point too yeah Christopher why in the hell is Australia not have anywhere to fish on here 100% I never even realized that man I bet I bet Christopher has why is there no Australian fishing that's weird there isn't. Ah, I got gotcha. you. Okay, yeah, I wasn't for sure where Sydney was located, but it looks like a the whole country looks like it'd be fun. But I know I know it's arid in a lot of the areas. around this for a little bit. Holy. Dude, that threw that thing a mile.
Bear with me, boys. I haven't. I just won this last last weekend. I haven't got to try it out or anything. It did not get us a big salmon. We know that much. But the African pike seem to love this thing, oddly enough. That much we have determined. That's the only thing about these spoons, boy. Dang, that was a big trophy though. Yeah, <clears throat> that is odd that they don't have one. Hopefully they will, man. Christopher, if you don't mind me asking, uh, besides fishing like on the, the shores and stuff, uh, what kind of fish do you guys fish for inland? Like, what do you guys have? I, I know it's a pretty arid continent, or at least to the best of my knowledge. What uh, What's kind of in whatever lakes or reservoirs you might have? What, what do you guys fish for like inland? away from the shore, fish-wise, like fish species.
if I want to accidentally. Uh, I'll see what time. What time is it? I'll see what time I get home, man. I need to look and see what the schedule is tomorrow anyway. <clears throat> I'll be off a little earlier from work tomorrow, but Thursday is going to be a longer day for me. Thursday and Friday. I don't know, boys. I don't know if this one's any better than that flat spin. Oh, 286. That is a that's a good weight. I was gonna say that today. That is the smallest. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's the smallest unique Nile perch you can get. So that's definitely gonna be like an 8090 or a 10 80 to 10 0. Oddly enough, I've got that before in the. Uh, I think I've told the story before, but. I think the Nile Emperor, the one long, one short, I got that once. <laughs> okay, so it's two-ish. Yeah, I should be on in time for it. I can't tell if it's a spotty. Oh, I'm sure this thing's good for numerous things in the game, but it's not exactly shocking and on me right now. Oh, we're already there. Alright, boys. We got a nice 51st place, and Pac-Man did held on third there, so good stuff, Pac-Man. Atta boy. Alright. Now, should I go? What the hell? Oh no, did I crash? I hope the guy miner not just didn't go down. What is going on? I'm froze. No. Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, makes sense, bro. I don't know. I'm thinking about using a leprechaun just for fun. I can easily do really good with the X-Series buzz bait, but I, maybe I should try it just for fun. So let's put that on there, and if it gets too bad, I'll go back to the go-to. But I don't know why it wouldn't. I don't think it would matter. We'll try it and see. That and maybe the Club Series crayfish on this one. Let's do those two, boys. Two, we'll do the Leprechaun Buzz this time. Leprechaun Buzz en route. Are you guys still there to my stream crash? I feel like my game's... Something's going on here. What the hell is going on? Is it my phone? All right, let me reset my. I think it's my phone. Well, I know I was playing a Dave's thing yesterday, and I thought the game just crashed, and then come to find out my whole internet was shot. So I'm already panicking. You guys know anybody that's went without nine hours without internet in this day and age is pretty tough.
Well, you better get the casting, Lucky. You're at Congo, bro. You ought to be making a fortune, man. You just got to grind. It's like doing the chores, bro. Ranking up on here is like doing the chores. You got to get all the work done before you can have fun. Get all your grinding done, bro. Best advice. Level up. Get it done. All right. Good luck, fellas. Good luck to whoever's playing along here. This could go good. Could go bad somewhere in between. Who knows? You know, in this one, if if you start catching, uh, if you start catching a bunch of bowfin, it's not going to be fun. Keith, you ever had the bowfin run in this one? <laughs> Let's hope neither one of us have the bowfin run. The bowfin run could be very, very painful on you. Not much in South Australia. I'm not sure how many species in other states, but barramundi up there on top. Oh, I have heard of the barramundi. I have heard of those. That's why I had to sit and try to think of a... I figured you'd name it, Christopher. All right, boys. Let's go see if we can dodge some bowfin. I'm going to try... I normally use my X-Series buzz bait because I have it, but I'm going to go ahead and try this leprechaun buzz. Just to see. It should do good. I don't know why it wouldn't. I used to use it way back in the day for fun. Before they even had this comp. So, Tom, where have you been? Don't tell me you've been working all day, bro. I'm kidding, Tom. What's up? My, my internet crashed on me yesterday, Tom. And then work this morning was not very fun either. So, What's up, buddy? Oh, this, is a, this should be midwater. Oh, you you instantly move since when you get one. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little more stubborn. Maybe not instantly. That's my that's my problem usually though. All right. Well, well it looks like we got a nice fish. It should if that's a bowfin, I don't know what the hell to say. Should be a trophy. All right. Well, good luck. I'm I'm doing the uh, I got a unique right off the first cast, so that's not a bad sign. I'm running uh. For my buddy Keith here, who's who's from Ireland, if he, nobody knew, I'm running the this leprechaun buzz for him. But yes, and Alex is giving you good advice, Lucky. Make sure that uh, you do grind, man. All you got to do is get to level 75 before that pass ends, and you got Congo unlocked permanently. So that is great advice. Both end boat anchors. Oh, you did the, okay, good, good, good. I was going to say, I put that up just to, not that you might not have thought of it, but I do think 4.0 is a nice, nice medium hook where you can get the big ones and keep your bite steady. But I would almost assume, I should have brought a little 4.0. I would almost assume you could just use the black 4.0 or white 4.0 with the nymphs or anything that you like to. I think that might be the trophy or a nice common with the trophy. Oh, perfect. That's a scoring fish. Let's keep casting and see if we can get the trophy within reason. If I don't, then we'll move. But ideally in this, you get the less empty cast you get, the better off you are. I know not to play the role of Captain Obvious, but. It's t here's here's what I kind of do, Tom. It's not 100% foolproof. Uh, I got the unique first cast, so I'm kind of I'm t depending on the spot. Learn your spots. I try to get five to seven bass, or until I get two empty casts in a row. Or like Keith said, if I if I get I don't do it as much as Keith does, but if I get two bowfin in a row, I'm gone. 
Keith said he rotates as soon as he gets a bow fan. Nice, Christopher. Yeah, that's bigger than mine, bro. I think I only got a 153-pound tarpon. That's been a long time since I got that. I don't know, Tom. I usually try to get uh, five to seven bass per spot. Maybe more, just depending. But I got the unique out here, so I'm I'm probably gonna go till I get an empty cast. But I really like to get the trophy before I leave. But that's just kind of the way I do it. But yeah, you could do it probably five minutes per spot or something like that. I think more importantly, make sure you know like this peak's low, so they should be. I mean, I'm catching them in the midwater because the barometer's down. And see, I think that's too both, and that's my sign to get the hell out of here. I'm gonna have to, no, I'm going to do one more cast. I probably shouldn't. Like I said, Lucky, it, it, farming up on here is like uh, doing the chores. Believe it or not, when I was doing the bait coin thing the other day, I was even doing it off stream, man, and I about fell asleep just farming bait coins, even though I know I'm getting bait coins every two, two per fish or whatever, but man. All right, I'm going to do one more, fellas, just because I'm scoring. Took your rod down 2%. All right, that should be the trophy. Unless I got a... All right, I'm definitely leaving after this fish, whatever the hell it is. I'm pretty sure it's a trophy. All right, that was ideal. Okay, so I got 77, about six and a, a little over six and a half minutes. I got 70 points from that. Hello, Josh, and thank you. Oh, that and flying fish in this one will kill you. Dude, am I too close? I feel like I'm too close. No, I'm not. I'm good. I'm good. Oh no. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That might, might be a big comment or a trophy. Okay. Whew. I thought that was the biggest bullfin I ever caught. That acted weird.
Both ends stay away. Oh god, I just talked myself into one, didn't I? No, bro. I knew it. Ugh. I don't know, but my wife made a nice beef stew. My stomach's getting ready to start growling because the whole house smells like it. I think my stomach is getting ready to growl. Come on, bro. Bite. Hit it. Hit it. Don't be a bullfin for crying out loud. No, it's not. Good, 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 good. Got you another unique. Good job, Lucky. Also, Lucky, one thing that I'll say for sure is... Even though you can do really well at, at day there, the one good advice I can give you when you're trying to level up fast, night skip. Figure out the night peaks that you like there. That way you're not sitting on slow fishing. So in other words, if it gets slow, you can just go from one night to the next and it doesn't cost you bait coins. That's one key tip I would say about power farming or trying to level as fast as you can. In other words, you can have just like a little two or three spot rotation you do, get a unique or two, a couple trophies, then just go right on to the next night where it's the highest peak and just maximize your time that way. It'll go a lot quicker for you. You're welcome, buddy. Everybody's helping you too, not just me, man. We got a good community. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, this one's going to get off. That thing literally charged me. Okay, I'm going to do... Should I do one more cast or leave? Definitely need speckling on my fish finder. Any videos made? Uh, pfft, yes, look up my Mighty 3 for these marks. Or I just put a lot of these marks up on my, uh, my podium. Look at my podium playlist. It would be quicker if you need speckled marks, Christopher. Mighty three podium, or I just podiumed on this a couple weeks ago, I think. If you need marks for this one. But they're pretty much in any little deep spot in these canals. I should probably rotate, but... This spot's hot right now. Alright, let's go. I guess I should go. You're welcome, Christopher. Thank you, Josh. All right, now this spot for sure is bad at both ends, but let's try it since it's close. talk myself right into the boat and I don't know what else to do I mean it's my next spot get in here bro you're gonna cut my hole on one boat is just gonna kill me dude nine pound or two shnikes there we go I can't be a boat fin too can't get me back to back boat fin can't that's gotta be a trophy 
Okay, I don't think it's a, it's a trophy. Trophy speckled. Come on. Anything but a bowfin. There we go. Holy cow, that's a unique... Uh... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm losing my mind, bro. Oh, guys, I'm tired, I think. <laughs> you guys don't even want to know what I thought that was. I thought that was a unique shoal. <laughs> oh, I'm getting old. I'm getting old, fellas. Wow. I would have swore that was a shoal, but that's all right. I didn't even have to say that, boys, but that's what I thought it was. Okay, that fish just flew off. That is not ideal. I might have to bounce. Hit it. Hit it. Nothing's going to hit it. That's too low. Ooh, nope. I dug it out of there. There we go. Is blue crab fun? Are you kidding me, bro? This map is a immense, dude. Top five map, in my opinion. I think most people would agree with me. Would you guys put Blue Crab currently as the top five map on PlayStation or on uh, Fishing Planet? Definitely. Yep. Even the... Uh, there's so many things to fish for here. There's a, a fish on here, Lucky, called Big Mouth Buffalo. They're a lot of fun. My number one map, uh, Amazonian Maze for me, man. The Amazonian Maze. Just because I like catching the shark, I think. Shark Triera, or Pima. Pariba can be fun. Speckled. And Amazonian, that's another thing about Blue Crab. It's just such an enormous map. I don't think they're going to give me the uni boys. Do I stick this thing out? I have to leave it. Oh, you didn't like it at first, Christopher? It's a fun map, man. You just It seems overwhelming because it's so big, but... Just remember, like, the salt water part of it down towards, or the brackish water, or whatever you'd call it, down there off the dock. That's where the bigger fish are. Uh, and then, obviously, the canals and the wide open area is where all the bass is. So just kind of remember that, and you'll, you'll be fine. You put you put blue crab number three. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. I think I don't know what I'd put for. Would you guys put? Where would you put four? Saint Croix. I'll tell you another map that's grown on me is uh, Sander Bagasy. I like Sander Bagasy too. That map's grown on me a lot the last few months. I used to hate Sander Bagasy too. Octuba, yeah, Octuba's a good map. Solange is a nice map. Yep, Solange is a good one. All right, I'm gonna have to bail out here. They're not gonna give me this unique. I'm just wasting away over here. Oh, they did give it to me. What the hell? They did give it to me. Well, that was fortunate. 15 pounder. We'll take it. Don't matter what, how big it is. I used to love Marin, but I don't know if it was lately or I've just had bad luck there or what. But, man, it's not uh, treating me kindly lately. All right, I'm skipping this spot. We're going right over here. Dude, I need to see my marker. Where the hell's my marker at? 
There it is. Octuba is dead for you. Thank you, Christopher. I don't know. I really like the... I used to... The pike and the asp at the tuba I like, especially the asp. If you like asp fishing on top water, I love that place. You can't get any... Oh, yeah. Cali's a good map. There's a lot of good maps. Yeah. Cali's a good map. I think Cali ruined me for a long time, Tom, because I did that sturgeon grind so long, man. All right, we got the unique out of the way fairly quick, so no, I'm not leaving yet, fellas. We got a nickel and dime. You like the small Zedek tuba? There ain't nothing wrong with that either. Lucky, you don't know what it was like back in the day. When we didn't have all these big maps, you were stuck at farming sturgeon. <laughs> Ooh. Boy. Yeah, I like catching them now. It's fun for the comps and stuff, but it wasn't back when you're off in the level up, it wasn't. Alright, this is a case where I'm trying to just get a common real quick and I'm bouncing out of here. I got the unique and the trophy. But I'm going to run out of spots if I'm not careful. Or not run out of spots, but I'm going to have to do a lot of traveling. I'm probably going to have to bounce. Perfect. Let's get the hell out of here. All righty. I could probably get a trophy there. I know the trophies don't overlap, but the uniques do. But let's go up here in this corner. Oh my God! I need to I need to mess with that and try that that one's that one is kind of tough to get, man. Uh, I gotta eat dinner and stuff. I, I might come back later. I'm not sure yet, Lucky. I got off of work around twelve twelve thirty, and then I went straight to streaming. So I need to eat dinner and stuff, man. Yeah, the Volga Xander for sure is the toughest one in the game. Make a grown man cry trying to get that uni out. Oh, don't you dare start both in me, bro. They're going to. They're going to both in me. Oh, God, they want my fish. That was a hog, too. Damn it. That's not good, fellas. He just flew off. Well, come on, there's got to be at least a butterfly over here, doesn't there? Oh, no. I 
hope this went dead. And I had a good pace going too. Oh, come on. Ain't no way, bro. One more cast. If it's empty, I got to leave. Not ideal though. We'll take it. Let's fish it out for a while. I don't have much time anyway. Better just camp it out for better or worse, boys. Unless it just gets hideous here. Oh, oh come on. the pick change? No, it's still low pressure. Something went horribly wrong for me, fellas. Are they lower? Like on the bottom well? Why can we get both in down here? higher since it's so shallow. Oh. Epic failure. Oh man, this is brutal, bro. For real. I had a good run going too. Missed it to fish. As long as it's not above fin. Anything will do. Even a butterfly. Trophy speckled now. Trophy speckled, please. Oh no, that was a common butterfly. I could tell by the size of the hit. Ooh, I got the unique out. I right, need one more fish, guys. And then we got a cross finish line. Give us anything. 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 Oh, this is risky. Oh, 
Oh, I can. I got to cross the finish line. Damn it. Let's go. Go, 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 go. This is going to be close this time, fellas. We may not make it. <laughs> what am I doing, though? I got to try to for one more. You guys have seen me mess this up before. Oh, I did it too, didn't I? Oh, no. I did it again. I did it. Did I get it? Did I? Did I not get it again? I don't know if I did or not. <laughs> oh, guys, you've watched me mess that up three times. Did I get it? <laughs> I don't know if I got it. <laughs> I got it. I doubt it'll hold, but it should hold top ten. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Man, I've you guys have watched me do that before and mess that up. I was trying to get one more fish. It'll hold top ten probably, maybe. <laughs> it won't hold third. <laughs> At least I'm on the leaderboard. I've done it before. <laughs> oh man, that was so close. Oh man, that was brutal. Woo, boys. Your unis went and cooperating. That's still a fun one no matter what, Keith. But I love the pressure. It's, that happens every time, though. Like, that's what's fun about that one, right? Because you're always going for that last-minute fish. <laughs> the last time, though, I wasted 22 seconds. <laughs> the last time I took second in that, I could have took first if I went for one more fish. So that's what I was trying to do there. But that about, yeah, that was, that was bad, fellas. That was bad. All right, guys, I'm going to eat dinner. I may or may not come back later. We'll see how it goes, but I need to eat dinner. My wife's made a wonderful uh, beef stew, which sounds really, really good. So I'm going to eat. I may or may not come back. If I do, it'll be these two quick in concession. So appreciate everybody tuning in. I thank you for uh, support of the channel and helping out one another as usual. So appreciate you guys tuning in again. And uh, we will see you guys later. And good luck to everybody. Enjoy the rest of your evening if I don't come back later. If not, I will. Let me look at tomorrow's schedule too. Hold on a second. I do get off a little earlier tomorrow. Ooh, I should be. Oh, Blazing Maze too. I don't think. I don't know if I'll be home in time for that one. But I will. All right. Yeah. Thanks, Christopher. I appreciate it, man. I do have. Ooh, there's a couple tomorrow that are fun. There's several good comps tomorrow. So. I should be home in time for this one for sure. Yep, yep, yep. For sure I'll be home in time for that one. So appreciate you guys tuning in and uh, we'll see you guys in the next one.